Oh, 
All right, all right. What's up, everyone? OG over here from Player Essence, and things have been glitching out on me. Nothing is resetting. <laughs> I don't know what's going on with, like, with my stream stats and stuff. Like, I'll fix it, and then it, it doesn't fix. It just resets. So, to whatever I had last. So, I'm sorry about that, guys. But welcome to another PE Live today. We got a good show for you guys, because I fix all this stuff over here. Got a good show for you guys. We're on hours. Mere hours before Joker drops. Mere hours before Joker drops. So thank you guys so much for joining me on this glorious day, April 17th, 2019. Let me tell y'all something right here. Let me tell y'all something right here real quick. This is the Hokage's message to the, to the ninja here in the village. You Twitter weirdos, y'all can come, you guys can come into here, okay? You Twitter, you Twitter weirdos, go ahead and come into here. But what you don't realize is that you doing this for free. You are wasting your time coming into here crying and complaining for free let me know when you realize that you want to have a life people want to be here because they want to spend their time here it's enjoyment entertainment but when you come here and you want to just come here just to troll because you're a twitter stalker and a weirdo with multiple accounts and you don't have a life or you feel that or you feel that this is gonna somehow annoy me or get to me in some way you don't realize that i built seven years up to this point and we got the ninja in the village ready to take you down as soon as you say something dumb. Don't waste your time. Don't waste your time. Don't waste your effort. This isn't some other person's stream where nobody's going to notice who you are. As soon as you say something dumb, you'll be clapped. Plain and simple. Plain and simple. Okay? Things are run a little bit differently around here. They don't call it the elite ninja village for nothing. Okay? So, weirdo in the chat, not even going to sit here and give you any type of clout. Then I, not even going to do it. Not even going to mention your name. First and last warning, you stalking me on Twitter. Now you coming over here with your stupid picture, with your dumb sunglasses, and stalking me on here. When you don't like my content, you don't follow me. Leave. First, last warning. Thank you for coming to the stream. Thank you for the free view. I appreciate that. But... Gonna have to have you chill, homie, okay? So, like I said, not even gonna say your name. You know who you are. Say something else dumb to try to sit here and troll. It'll be, you're done. You clapped, okay? And this is for the entertainment of my village. I don't care or know who you are. You're an ant. You're a complete ant here where you're at. You're an ant in this life, okay? Nobody knows or cares who you are. I know you're looking for clout, looking for attention. That's fine. You ain't even gonna get me to say your name, man. So just chill. Enjoy the show. And be entertained. Sit down, shut up, and enjoy. Sit down, shut up, and enjoy the entertainment, the free entertainment that you're getting, homie. All right. So let's go and let's get into the ninja news for today. Sorry about that, guys. You know when the Hokage has to put his foot down, the Hokage has to put his foot down. You know what I'm saying? Like we gotta we gotta make sure we let people know in these streets, you know? Gotta let people know in these streets. So thank you guys so much for joining me today. I do appreciate all the real fans that are here. We got a good show for you guys. Already got 150 people in here. Make sure you hit that like button and share the stream if you can. Let's get some more people in here. Let's uh, continue going on and uh, we'll kind of say that. Shout out to everybody here. Ninja News, you guys all know what's going down today. Joker's going down. We're streaming as soon as he goes live. We're streaming. So just be ready for that, guys. Be ready. Get ready. We're going we're gonna to be streaming as soon as soon as soon as he's ready to go. So, uh, so shout outs to True Dog, True Dog X with a dollar donation through Super Chat. Thank you so much, True Dog X. That does make you the top stream ninja. And uh, my boy, she can all to look upon you. Thank you for the dollar donation, True Dog. True Dog X with that Dallas. Hollis for the Dallas. Thank you, man. Appreciate that. All right. Um, all right, so let's continue on here with uh, the shout outs. Shout outs, if you want me to say hi to you, feel free. Guys, stop crying about what's going to get nerfed or not already. All right, chill out. We'll talk about that. So uh, just say hi and I'll say hi back to you. Then we'll talk about all that. Um, it's, it, it drops at 530. You didn't watch my video today, Solomon Solo. It drops at 530, my boy. 530 uh, p.m. PT. That's 830 p.m. Eastern time. Um, let's see here. TCRX Gaming says, what up? Uh, looking forward to trying out Joker. Yep. What's up, Ray? How's it going? Um, Blue Satire, what's up, man? How's it going? Says the man, the myth, the legend. Uh, Star Mix, what's up, man? P10, what's good? Dinas, shout out to Dinas. Jazzy, what's up, Jazzy? Um, Elite Ninja Jazzy. Elite Ninja Hunter in 64 is here. Elite Ninja uh, Dinas, once again. Elite Ninja Tyler Epic, what's up, man? Um, thank you so much. Uh, is acting? It's acting up Streamlabs? Yeah, maybe a little bit. 
Uh, Nyko, what's good? Snake, how's it going? Uh, Blazer Link, what's good? Blazer Link, good to see you here. Lead Ninja Blazer Link here. Rodrigo Gamer, weeaboo. Phil, Galaxy B, Isaac Sullivan, Elite Ninja, Fairy Tiger, Renengon user, Fairy Tiger, co captain of the Viking Nation is here. GG's is here. What's up, man? Hunter N64, um, once again, Judge the Four, Glenn, Gunslinger, KJ2399, Dave Gaming, Elite Ninja Dave Gaming is here as well. Monkey Boy, Elizabeth, Lizzie's here. Good to see you here, Lizzie. Civilized Son, Renengon user, Civilized Son is here. Um, Cody Shadley, what's up, man? Uh, Super Mosh 1990, what's up, dude? Eddie. Eddie, been a while. Dude, Eddie, where have you been, bro? It's been like, I haven't seen you here in months. Maybe since like last year or something like that. I mean, yo, how's it going, man? J2 Blue, what's up, J2 Blue? Elite Ninja J2 Blue. Sexy Jutsu, uh, or <laughs> Sexy Jutsu Master. Uh, Skartic Light with the subscription. Thank you so much, Skartic Light. Welcome to Elite Ninja Village of Player Essence. We have high expectations of you, my boy. Thank you so much for joining the village. Uh, Balto Dirtfish, what's good, man? Yo, Iron Ninja putting his foot down. Man, sometimes you got to put it down. Sometimes you got to put the foot down on some of these Twitter weirdos. They don't realize that I don't need I don't need you guys to be like a lot of YouTubers are out here. Yeah, subscribe. They they won't they won't, you know, put their foot down on on subs because because they don't need them around, you know what I'm saying? Like they don't they don't need them like or they want their numbers to be high. The thing about it is that our village is so solid. We don't need to have 200 or 300 or 400,000 YouTube subscribers. I mean, we'll probably get there someday if I keep on doing this, but we don't need that. We're doing just fine with the dedicated ninja here and the new ones that want to come and be a part of something better than the typical, oh, you go to a YouTube chat, nobody the YouTuber the, the person streaming doesn't even know who you are, doesn't care who you are, no personality, sit there, play a game, and look at the chat every single five minutes, you know, or only say something when somebody donates or something like that, you know what I'm saying, or only answer a question when that happens. We're trying to do things completely different here, so I don't give a damn if I lose numbers, or, I, which, which I lose subscribers all the time, that's fine, I don't care, get the hell out, I don't want them here, I want people here that want to change the landscape, I want people here that are really willing to make a difference and be a part of something better uh, as a community, not this typical YouTube garbage that we see. You know what I'm saying? We're just a bunch of weirdos in chat saying dumb things. I don't want that. I've never wanted that. And that's what Player Essence is about. Shout out to Fuzzy. Uh, is that Fuzzy? 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 Fuzzy Moto. Thank you so much for the subscription. Thank you so much, man. I appreciate that. Welcome to the Legion Village, my boy. I think I saw you in here talking about different stuff. Um, Real quick, guys. People who don't have profile pictures, get profile pictures, please. Uh, for those who don't have profile pictures, um, let's see here. Always learning 60, paint fat purple. What's good? Dronzy, what's up, man? Mandy Lee, what's up, Mandy Lee? Good to see you here. Oh, nice little uh, Sheningon ticks on there. Thank you, man. Uh, Red Enigma, what's good, man? It said, put the foot down on the jabronis. Yeah, man. Sometimes you got to put the foot down on those pre genins you know? Um, let's see here. Uh, why does Joker release so late? Because he does. Uh, let's see here. Um uh let's see here uh oh nasty what's good kid raccoon gabriel what's good man been working a lot and going to school it's all good man good to, good to see you back in here soul talks and gaming listening while working it's all good man Zeno, what's up man sam yargo what's good boy z boy z in the house slayer what's good um embler bend he says yo i'm hyped ian morley reningon or no not reningon shiringon user ian morley is here good to see you here elite ninja uh, let's see here. Party man. Shout out to Renning Gun user Party Man. The bodyguard. The bodyguard. Party man. Bamuelson, what's good, man? How's it going? Gabecom21, what up? Um, hit that like button, says Hunter N64, one of the elite ninja here. Definitely. Pearly21, I'm doing good, man. How are you doing today? The big, the, the big, is the bigs, the bigs man. What's up, man? Um, 5.30 p.m. PT, guys. 5.30 p.m. PT. Uh, Edgar, yo, Edgar, where you been, homie? Good to see the Elite Ninja Edgar almost going towards that, working towards that Sharingan. Good to see you here, man. What's up, Edgar? Um, Jumpmon. What's up, Jumpmon? Shout out to my boy Jumpmon. When's your badge changing? Seems like you've been Sharingan forever. Okay, yeah, very soon. Very soon you'll be uh, part of the Renengan users, one, one of the few super elites here. Um, let's see here. Uh, we got that big <laughs> Well, I've always got this energy. Calm down, Jazzy. Uh, Beetlejuice. What? Beetlejuice. Yo, homie. Where you been, dog? Dog, where you been? Beetlejuice, good to see you here as well, man. Shout outs. Uh, Five Nights and Freddy's, what up? Uh, did, my, uh, did my badge change or is that tomorrow? It's got to be tomorrow because your badge hasn't changed yet, Sean. So it's got to be tomorrow. Uh, Tenchiho, what's up, man? Um, Gizmo, what's up, Gizmo BH54? Good to see you here. 
Um, all right. Uh, let's see. Nothing early. Just glad to see you. Uh, you still killing it. Yo, shout out to my boy. Good to thank, thank you for the continued support on the channel. All right. So what do you guys want to get? You guys want to get into this whole uh, Switch Mini League since we already got 205 viewers. Thank you guys so much. I do appreciate all of you guys being here. So um, let's get into this. Uh, let's get into this Twitter uh, stuff that I saw with this Switch Mini. Uh, this fake Switch Mini thing that was going on here fake switch mini thing that was going on and you know I, first of all guys first of all follow me on twitter follow me on twitter i'm gonna put a link in, in the description here or sorry in the chat uh, there is a link in the description but make sure you guys follow me on twitter yo what's up murdoch loco good to see you here my boy elite ninja murdoch loco in the house uh so you guys follow me on twitter if you're not already following me uh but let's check out this leak here or not this leak let's check out this uh this switch mini which is obviously fake this shell for this switch mini uh this is a fake thing that's the reason why i wanted to talk about it because people are trying to spread this around as if it, it might be real or questioning whether it's real or not and it's not real it's fake um so we're gonna go ahead and go over straight over to this and um as you guys can see right here a uh, shout outs to uh daniel ahmed who's a big dude on twitter i think he has how many he has a lot of followers yeah he's like a hundred thousand or i know he has a lot anyway i don't know how is he not verified at this point anyway either way he does like he crunches numbers for like nyko like some chinese company or something like that um and uh he posted up this he says someone posted a supposed switch mini shell on chinese social media real or fake and i'm gonna go ahead and say a fake you know what i'm saying like super fake bro like fake <laughs> like bleh, fake you know what i'm saying like it, it's uh it's definitely fake look at this look at the quality of this they shot this with the game boy camera dude the like game boy camera color i mean what what is going on with the quality of this photo bro like out here looking like looking like my first camera like fisher price like what's going on here like what, what what's going on here with with this with this fisher fisher price camera this is definitely a, a fake thing with this switch, this back of this switch case. I, I don't see it. I don't see this being real at all. You know what I'm saying? Like it's, or it's probably, it's probably, like, it's like, <laughs> it's like one of those knockoff Chinese. Uh, it's like the, <laughs> the switch Nintendo, the switch. It's, it's called the switch Nintendo, not the Nintendo switch. That's probably something for that, man. People out here faking up, faking stuff, man. Uh, so, so yeah, man. It is what it is there. Yo, what, what up, K19? Good to see you here, my boy. Um, let's see here. Has Nintendo taken the photo down? Nintendo's not going to take this photo down. I mean, if they've taken it... What do you mean, if they, have they taken it down yet? Nah, they haven't. Look. <laughs> Look, it's still up. This isn't real. This is this is not a real thing. You know what I'm saying? Uh, but what, what is with the... What's with this weird rainbow over here to the... <laughs> Like this, like somebody said. Let me let me add a little. Let me add a little pizzazz. Let me add a little pizzazz to it. This is like somebody took like a Game Boy Color and Lisa Frank put together. Y'all remember Lisa Frank back in the day? <laughs> somebody took a, a Lisa Frank a Lisa Frank camera with with the Game Boy Color and said, "All right, guys, let's let's go." <laughs> Let's go, let's go ahead and let's go ahead and do this. <laughs> if you gotta be older to remember Lisa Frank, you gotta be older. If you don't remember Lisa Frank, then you're not old enough to remember Lisa Frank. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's the cover of the hand. They don't, uh, they don't want to show the, I um, show the uh, the back. No alcohol, lot, bruh. This is the least. This is the least to cover their hand. I mean, come on though. I mean, you can't put anything but like a Lisa Frank. Being on this, on this here, man. Uh, Anthony knows this looks like a protective shell. I mean, that's that's what it is. That that's what it is. It's it's a shell. That's that's what I put in the. That's what I put in the title of the, of the thing here. It, it's a shell for the supposed Switch Mini. It's not the Switch Mini itself. It's a shell for a Switch Mini, but it's a fake shell for a Switch Mini. So, I mean, I don't believe this Lisa Frank Switch Mini thing. You know. Uh, so let's see what he has to say here. It seems to be fake based on a few things, such as the model number. And the FCC ID on the back um, being the same as the original Switch. So probably just a 3D print or something. Yeah, pretty much. I, I can see it as like a 3D print or something like that, man. I mean, I, I can I can see it as that. Um, I remember Lisa Frank. She is making a comeback. Is, is Lisa Frank making a comeback? Bruh. Now, she used to have all those little beads and shoes and necklaces and all sorts of stuff that you can make like... Um, like uh, uh, bracelets, just all sorts of stuff that you can string together as like a kid and put things like make. It was like for like little girls, uh. But yeah, Lisa Frank. It was back in the day. You used to like if you had like book um like uh book orders. Like they used to give you like when I was a kid. They don't do this anymore. But when I was a kid, 
That's what they used to do. They used to, like, when you go to school, I don't know if they still do this. Maybe they do, but I don't remember my, my daughter bringing home anything from this. But, um... And maybe I know I do remember her doing something, but it was different. It was like a fundraiser. But they used to they used to hand out these things to schools called book orders, and they used to be all sorts of colorful, weird. Like you can get like little toys and little trinkets, and like every it was like every like quarter or whatever you would get a book order, and you can order something really cool from there. So so yeah, I just remember Lisa Frank and different types of like Arthur or whatever, like different types of books. Um, Clifford. Just stuff like that that you can order from there. And Lisa Frank was, like, always featured on there, like, when I'd be looking through the book order. Uh, so, so yes, classic book orders. <laughs> Showing my age here. You got to be in your late 20s, probably mid to late 20s or 30s or above to know about book orders. Because I, I don't think they do that anymore. But from what I understand, because, like, I have a daughter that's old enough to be at the same time when I was getting book orders. And I don't, she, ain't, she never came home with the book order. She came home with fundraiser stuff but never a book order. So, so yeah, man. Um, I remember them, uh, classic book order form. Yeah, yeah, man. They were like, they were like, I think they had like, mine had like white trim with like yellow, like the pages were yellow with white trim. And like, there was just all sorts of color for stuff with the prices right next to them. And I'd be like, man, I ain't got money for none of this. My mom would only get me one a year. I was only allowed one book order a year. So man, I really thought hard about what I was, I was like, mm. like, I'd be thinking I'd sit in my room. And I'd be looking through that book order like crazy, like which one of these Clifford books am I going to buy? Which 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 one of these Arthur's am I going to buy here? You know what I'm saying? So it was uh, it was interesting. It was interesting back in the day. Um, he said, "Well, I don't see why you're saying it's it's BS." Uh, but I mean, you say you're 15. You remember those back from elementary? Like I said, I I don't know if they still do it or not. I mean, I'm not trying to sit there and say that they don't. I'm just. I'm just saying, I'm not sure if they do. I was very clear. So there's no need to be, it seems, seems like you're upset uh, that, that, <laughs> that, I, that I didn't know that 15-year-olds, that you're a little, calm down, Tyke. Jesus Christ. Calm down, Tycho. Um, um, so anyway, um, let's see here. Um, so Dreamcast guy, I don't know if he's spewing that, he's, that it's real. I think he thinks that the Switch Mini is real. I don't know if he thinks that this actual thing is real, so... So there you go. Um, all right, so let's go ahead and get back to here, guys. Um, so uh, yeah, so yeah, that's basically the whole Switch Mini thing. It's not really anything really that's. Um, I think that's real, um, but hey, we'll have to wait and see. Um, so my kid still, my kid still brings them. Okay, they still bring them. All right, so they're still, they're still around. So they're still around. That's cool. That's cool. I think it's like a 3D laser print art thing. That's what I think it is. Kind of like how, like, you guys remember how Etika. Um, made uh, that the fake Joy-Con, like the fake Joy-Con controllers, right? Like with the 3D print. And, and then like somebody made like the fake Stewie Griffin Nintendo Switch controller too. You guys remember that? Remember that Stewie Griffin football controller that people were saying like with the screen on there and the, the analog sticks? I mean like the Stewie Griffin controller too. So I mean like, I mean this type of stuff happens all the time, dude. Um... So, 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 yeah, um, Etika with the fake Switch, yeah, it was like a fake Switch, like, Joy-Con, wasn't it, like, the Joy, the Joy-Con controllers, I think he also did a Switch, too, right, but he, I remember he did Joy-Con controllers, too, um, but, yeah, either way, yeah, that, that, that was that, you know what I'm saying, so, there you go on that, guys, it's, it's fake, it's, it's not, it's not real, um, don't, don't worry about it, don't think that it's real, I don't think it's real, so, uh, so, yeah, anyway, Moving on to the next topic here, uh, we're going to talk about some few more tidbits with uh, Joker. Um, you know, the 11 song, I mean, S Sakurai actually didn't really give more tidbits. He just basically talked about it. You're going to get like Joker's dropping tonight, guys. We, you, you guys all know Joker's dropping tonight. Um, and Joker is going to come with the Persona stage, which we've talked about in, you know, various different videos already. Live reaction, you guys saw that. We also saw it with um, on my video that I did this morning. Um, Joker's gonna come with uh, eleven songs from the Persona franchise. I think it's like three, three from Persona Four, four from Persona um, Three, then like four from like Persona Five. Uh, some new arrangements and stuff like that, sounding really good, really high quality, nice stuff there. Um, he's gonna come with the stage mementos, and based on what music is playing, like the kind of the color of the stage and kind of what happens with it, the interactivity will change as well so really cool it's actually really cool um i'm loving what they're doing with joker i talked about it in my video too i mean like joker just looks so dope he doesn't look high tier like a lot of like i mean anti who just by the way just got picked up by uh t1 
which is uh, I think a South Korean um, South Korean esports organization. But anyway, one of my favorite content creators and Smash Brothers players, um, Anti, uh, said that he's, he said he doesn't think that uh, based off what they showed, he doesn't think that Joker's kind of like broken or anything like that, or is going to be broken. And the same thing with me. I don't think Joker just looks like a Joker looks like a solid mid tier, mid top, like higher mid tier. You know what I'm saying, or like a, a high tier, like a low end high tier. You know, like I'm I'm kind of looking at Joker in that response from what I've seen. Now, once again, that could change later tonight once we start playing. Um, but yeah, we'll have to wait and see. But let's talk about update 3.0. Let's talk about buffs and nerfs if what's going to happen here because a lot of you guys were already popping off in the chat and saying, "Well, I think this is going to happen." Well, I think, oh, Wolf, look, listen here, guys. Let me tell y'all what's going to happen. Wolf is getting nerfed. Okay. If Wolf doesn't get nerfed, it will be a miracle. It will be an absolute miracle if Wolf is not nerfed in update 3.0. It will be a miracle. I think his blaster is going to get nerfed. I think the hitbox on his blaster is going to get nerfed. I think the damage output is going to get nerfed on his blaster. Not the distance that it goes, but the... Um, the, the hitbox might get nerfed some way, and I think that the damage output's going to get nerfed. Just that's just that's just what I think, man. I, that's just what I think. Um, just because Wolf, he's obviously an S tier, you know, or some people have him very upper, upper, upper A tier, but um, he's obviously an S. In my opinion, he's a clear S tier. Like Wolf is a clear S tier in the game. You know, um, he doesn't have many weaknesses. You know, really, he's slow. His recovery can be gimpable. However, it's very risky to try to gimp his recovery because he has crazy hitboxes on his up B and his side B. Um, but he is slow and his recovery isn't the best in terms of distance. So the, he does have some clear weaknesses uh, because his foot speed is, he's just slow. Wolf is just not fast at all. Um, so I don't think he's going to get like too much of a big nerf. But I mean, like, I think he's going to get a blaster nerf. Um, I don't really think he needs to be nerfed at all, though. If you guys want my opinion, nobody should be nerfed. Not a single character in the game should be nerfed. It should only be buffs. You know what would be great if everybody was S tier, <laughs> but that's not that's never gonna happen. But like we just need buffs. We don't need nerfs. I don't really think personally after Shuton, you know, won with Olimar, and we haven't really seen an Olimar win a big tournament yet. I mean, we're seeing uh, we're seeing like you know MK Leo kind of use Marth again. You know, I mean, we're seeing. I mean, Ike people were talking about how Ike how good you know Ike has won a major tournament before. I mean, we're seeing a lot of variety in terms of who wins. I know uh, Cosmos is doing his thing with Inkling. Um, I'm mean, even seeing Zero get pretty far using Cloud. So we know Cloud's viable. Um, I think Cloud could win a tournament, could win a big tournament. Uh, we saw Mars use ZSS, which nobody puts ZSS in, in the S tier category. Everybody puts her in maybe like a lower. Some people even put her in a B tier character. You know, because of that laggy grab that she has. Grabs are already bad in this game. And then she also has a tether grab, which even makes things worse. You know, that's super laggy. So, I mean, we saw, we saw you know, Mars do his thing and beat Nairo with, uh, with uh, ZSS. You know, Palutena is a good character. Palutena has won big tournaments, you know. Uh, Nairo won a tournament with Palutena. Um, I think there's plenty of, I mean, there's, there's no need for nerfs. Like why change somebody in one tier to another? Just buff the bad characters, just buff the bad characters and leave everybody else the same. I don't really think like, Ze like people out here talk about Zelda. You know what I'm saying? Some people, Zelda doesn't need a, Zelda doesn't need a nerf. She needs zero nerfs. Like into that, like I said, to those Twitter gyms, to those Twitter gyms. You know, to that, to that, to that, by the way, I'm going to have a video on Scrappy Doo, by the way. Like, he wasted too much of my time yesterday. And I didn't, I, you know, I, I wanted to make my value of my time that I put at him. I valued my time that I wasted on, on Scrappy Doo at about $100. That's what I valued my time that I wasted, in my opinion. So, therefore, I need to make a video to make up for my lost time talking to Scrappy Doo, who was a follower on Twitter. Um, so, we're going to have a video. We're going to have a nice, funny video on Scrappy Doo. Um, we're just going to call him Scrappy Doo. Um, so, uh, so yeah, we're gonna have a nice video on Scrappy Doo. Um, but anyway, that will be later. Um, but anyway, either way, um, let's see. Mortal Kombat Switch gameplay is out. Um, we'll talk about that in the next topic. We'll talk about that in the next topic. Um, so yeah, that's basically, I mean, you guys let me know if your 3.0, um, update stuff, 3.0 update. So what do you guys think? Tag me at player essence or hashtag player essence. Yeah. Greninja nerf. It's coming, right? Um, 
Oh, okay. T1 picked up Larry Lur and Anti. Okay, nice. That is very nice. T, uh, T1 picked up Larry Lur and Anti. Good stuff, man. Kind of like the new Immortals. You know how Immortals picked up, like, uh, Dewan from uh, Melee um, um, and, uh, sh or Shroomed. And they also picked up Anti a, a few years ago, and then they kind of let them go. Now T1 picking up uh, Larry Lur and uh, Anti. So that's nice, man. Uh, nah, Greninja needs a buff. It's it's a joke, Hunter N64. Because remember how they just kept on nerfing Greninja? Which Greninja needed a side B nerf. I think he personally needed a side B nerf in the original game. Uh, or sorry, in, in Smash 4. But, I mean, we'll see how they do it. Um, Joker comes out at 5.30, 5.30 p.m. PT. 5.30 p.m. PT, man. Um, let's see here. Uh, putting gyms in their place. Yeah, putting he, he, he's scrappy. He's a scrappy Jim Scrappy Doo. That's his. I think that's his full name. Jim Jim Scra Scrappy Doo. Jim Jimmy Jimmy Scrappy Doo. Yeah, sorry. Um, Ace is gonna break on did a, a persona arrangement. Yeah, it's gonna be nice. It's gonna be very nice. Yes, he does. Zelda's broken. Nerf her to the ground. <laughs> Andre, chill. <laughs> I know you're just joking around, but nah, man. Nah, nah. Um, guys, the whole Greninja thing, Greninja being nerfed, that's just a joke because in Smash 4, Greninja got nerfed all the time. Even though, like, nobody was winning any tournaments with Greninja, nobody felt that Greninja was, like, super S tier or anything, just, like, a solid high tier. Like, they just kept on nerfing the hell out of Greninja. Like, every time Greninja got nerfed, Greninja got nerfed, Greninja got nerfed. And everyone's like, why are they nerfing Greninja to the ground? Like, nobody is complaining about Greninja being overpowered or anything. And they just kept nerfing Greninja. Like, they just kept nerfing him. And so that's the reason why people say, better nerf Greninja. Hey, Wolf Blaster, Wolf, Wolf Blaster's too good. Inkling's Roller too good. Uh, you know, Peach too good. Better nerf Greninja. Um... Let's see here. Uh, Zelda, Zelda is broken. Dude, she's totally broken. Party Man says, I agree. People insist that Peach and Wolf need nerfs because they just have problems fighting against them. But once you learn how to fight against Wolf, and, like, I fight against Wolves all the time with Sheiks, and believe it or not, even, like, even, like, uh, yo, what's up, Vanessa? How's it going? Um, even, like, uh, like, elite wolves that i can see play and know because they're doing fair strings and all that you know i beat some good wolves obviously i can't beat like a wolf like the quality of like some of the like seagull joe or some of the professional players out there um but like a lot of the wolves that i've played that i know that know what they're doing on elite smash you know i've beat them with chic like but then again i'm a wolf main so i know how to use i know how to use wolf you know same thing with peach i've beat some elite peach peach players but like once again peach can be outranged I mean, yeah, she can combo the hell out of you and her fair. I mean, she can edge guard. I mean, but she has to work for it. She has to float. She has to go off stage. I mean, Peach just doesn't. I mean, her projectile is kind of weak. You know, it's just like a turn of slow. I mean, it can combo, but her projectile isn't like. There's way better projectiles. Like Nikita's way way better. I mean, like I would even say like Falco Blaster is way better. Um, I would even say like Wolf. I mean, there's way better projectiles than you know Peach's turn up. Although it's good, but there's way better projectiles than Peach's turn up. So I, I don't think Peach needs a nerf. I know a lot of people talk about that, but I, I don't. I really don't think she needs a nerf. Um, I already know there's Mortal Kombat Switch gameplay, guys. I or I literally just talked about that. Like I just said, hey, we're gonna move on to that in about a minute or so. Okay, we're still on this, so give us just a bit, and then we'll talk about the Mortal Kombat Switch gameplay. Okay, but I literally just said that. I said, all right, Mortal Kombat Switch gameplay. We'll talk about it. We'll we'll talk about it in just a bit. You know what I'm saying? So we'll get to it in the next topic. I don't need like 15 reminders. I got it. Thank you guys. Um, and we'll we'll show it off in just a bit, okay? Let's just finish up this topic with 3.0 and what you guys have to say, and then we'll move on to Mortal Kombat, okay, guys? Um, most characters are vi viable if you put the work in. Um, I know I won't because I'm not willing to put, put in the time. Well, I mean, I mean anybody in Smash Ultimate, anybody can be, even like the low tier characters, right? Like Little Mac, like Little Mac's very strong on the ground. He has a lot of super armor. He's just really bad when you're off stage. But I mean, like, yeah, if you put in the work, I mean, I'm pretty sure you can be viable with them. But I mean, are you going to beat Nairo? Or are you going to beat any of the best characters in the game? Like best players? Probably not. Um, Digman says, I agree. We don't need uh, we don't need any nerf. To be fair, the person that needs a buff is Little Mac. Oh, I'm hyped for Jokerathon tonight. Yeah, I think Little Mac might need a little bit of a buff. Um, I, Arash, yeah, I already know that Joker's in four hours. I'm very well aware of that. I don't think you're watching my videos. Um, I knew the exact time. So I'm very aware of when Joker's coming to Smash Brothers, so that thank you. Um, let's see here. I'm dead serious. Um, I was doing one v ones against someone using random, and I have uh, it, it have me Zelda, and I three stocked him. Easiest hundred dollars <laughs> ever. Easiest hundred dollars ever. So you're using so Andre, you were using randoms, and and you were <laughs> and you three stocked him. Easiest hundred bucks that you ever made, dude. I know, seriously, it's, it's such an easy thing, dude. What was that person, Scrappy Doo? Let me just love. Were you fighting against? Was his name Scrappy Doo? Was it? Was his handle Scrappy Doo? 
Come on, let me at him! Let me at him! Let me at him! I'm three stocked with randoms! I'm three stocked with randoms! Come on, let me at him! Let me at him! Oh man, I can't run! I love Smash! I hate Smash! I love Smash! I hate Smash! Let me at him! You suck, man! I'm three stocked with randoms! Alright, put a hundred on it. Ah! I mean, um, well, ah, well, um... Why, why, is, why is there gotta be money on the line? I, well, I'll bother you free, though. But why is there gotta be money? Uh, well, I have to actually... I have to actually work for my money. You, 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 you make that in, in, in one day. Bro, it took me seven years to build this platform. Scrappy. Scrappy, dude. Go on, let me at him. I'll buy you so free. I'll take you on. You can't fight me. Looking like retarded Conor McGregor in, in, in Twitch. <laughs> Going like this, dude. I'll buy you no problem. All right, hundred dollars. I got no, there's no. How can I? Well, that, that's just not fair. That, that, ha, ah. <laughs> he was so confident until I said a hundred dollar money match. <laughs> oh my gosh, uh, what's the fake switch cell? We already talked about the fake switch cell. Uh, you can record, you can rewind if you want to know about that, uh, or you can wait till the random, uh, random Q name. We'll talk about it some more. Uh, should we be worried? Worried about what? Um, let's see here. Uh, that needs to be clipped. Uh, he didn't want to lose money. Well, he said that he'd body me free. No problem. He said, he, I know he didn't want to lose money, but he said that he'd body me free. No problem using randoms and three stock me. So, I mean, like, like I said, we got, we got to talk. <laughs> Scrappy dude, man. Um, let's see here. Uh, OJ, let, let's have a money match one-on-one. -on -one. You'll get these hands. Money match one-on-one. -on -one. All right. Um, I don't have a problem. Like the thing about it is like, I don't even need a money match if it's just one-on-one. -on -one. But the, only, the only reason why I money matched him, the only reason why I money matched him is because he said he beat me 3-0 with randoms. If he just said, if it was just a regular match and Scrappy Doo wanted to, wanted to catch some hands, then I probably would have said, okay, we'll just have a little match. Let's make it a little bit of an event. You know what I'm saying? Um, but the fact that he started adding a little bit of extra sauce on it, I said, okay, money match. Because now you're trying to sit there, you're trying to embarrass somebody, or you're trying to be, you know, I don't know what you're trying to do. You're being overconfident, or you're trying to embarrass me, or whatever the case is. So if you want to do that, then okay, let's raise the stakes. Because now, because now at this point, you're trying to embarrass somebody. You're, it's not a fair fight. It's not something that you, I mean, you're sitting here saying, I'm going to play randoms. I'm going to three stock you. Okay, that's fine. You want to tr talk trash? Okay, that's fine. Then let's, let's, let's raise up the stakes. You know what I'm saying? Let's raise up the stakes. Um, so, so yeah. So yeah, and you know what you said, bro. You just remember why? Good. If you unsubscribe, why are you here? Here, let me let me help you on the way out. Let me help you on the way out, Mizza. Get out of here. Get out of here. Thank thanks for un thanks for unsubscribing. We don't want you here in the first place. Get the hell out of get the hell out of here. We don't want you here. Why are you? If you unsubscribe, why are you here? Why are you here? <laughs> Freaking loser! Get out of here. Um. What? I don't understand. Thank you for reminding me for why I unsubscribed. What are you doing here? Do you watch channel? What are you doing here? Bye, Felicia. Ms. Garbage. Look at that fake, fake account. Get out of here. I've never seen, I have never seen you here. I have never seen you make one comment or even be in one live stream. Get out of here, freaking liar. People on the internet be lying like hell, dude. You're a lot. I've never seen you here at all. Never seen that name. Or using sock accounts? Using sock accounts? Get the hell out of here. We don't want you here anyway. We got 232 people here. We don't need you. You're only one. You're nothing. You're an ant. Moving on. Um, let's see here. Oh, when will Joker come? Guys, I've already said this multiple times. Joker's coming at 5.30 p.m. PT. That is 8.30 p.m. Eastern time. Um, 8.30 p.m. Eastern time. Um, so yeah, man, oh, let's see here. That, that dude who challenged you, why is he running? Cause he didn't want, he didn't want to, he didn't want to lose money. Cause he knows he's all talk. He's, he knows he's all talk. All right, guys, let's move on to some Mortal Kombat gameplay. Mortal Kombat gameplay here. Um, Mortal Kombat gameplay. Let me look it up. So where is this Mortal Kombat switch gameplay at guys? Where is this Mortal Kombat switch gameplay at? Um, all right, so I, I found it. It's on Nintendo everything Shout outs to Beetlejuice with a three dollar donation. It says You're done You're done You're done You're done. Yeah, you're done man. Get out of here. We don't need we don't I don't like I said I don't need you here 
We the village does not need your subs. I don't need your one subscriber counter. I don't need you. I don't need you, bro. I don't need you. More successful than you, better looking than you, got a bigger footprint online than you, got a bunch of the ninja that back me up. We don't need you. Plain and simple. I don't know why these weirdos come here and like seriously, like, nobody needs you, bro. Leave. What are you doing here? People act like they get mad. Like, leave, bro. <laughs> nobody asking for you to be here. Um well, he was already... All right, so Mortal Kombat Switch gameplay. Let's go in and get my first reaction to... Okay, hold up, hold up. I'm going to clip this. All right, guys. Let's go in and get my first reaction to Mortal Kombat Nintendo Switch gameplay. All right, first reaction to Mortal Kombat Switch gameplay going down right here. This is the first time ever that we're seeing this. Uh, you guys let me know right here during the live stream. Everybody subscribe. <laughs> as soon as one jabroni leaves, we get real ninja to join the village. Let's go. All right, let's go ahead and move over here to this reaction... And uh, we're going to check out some of this gameplay, Mortal Kombat Switch gameplay. Shout out to the Nintendo Everything. Uh, looks like Warner Bros. posted a, a video on it. So we're going to go ahead and uh, move over to this here and check out some of this Mortal Kombat Switch gameplay. The realms are in crisis. We've got okay. to take out another realms army now. Okay, it's actually we're looking pretty good. Another war. We must fight for each other. It's not, not bad. each other. Yo, that's actually looking pretty dope! The arc of the universe bends to my will. Okay. It's like a mirror reflecting the past. Oh, that's freaky like Friday. The shot! Our face! <laughs> what is that? Ah, he's gonna get us killed. Take your fight on the go. The environments are definitely lower. Still looks good though, it doesn't look bad. All portable mode too. buy this game for the culture you gotta you gotta buy this game for the culture man that, that that's that's really the only you gotta buy this game for the culture plain and simple you gotta do it for the switch for the switch culture man if you ain't buying this game just because of the fact that mortal kombat is returning there's something wrong there's something wrong there's something definitely wrong um although i do gotta change the top stream ninja text because bill just did the three dollar donation not true dog uh, sorry about that, Beetlejuice. Uh, but either way, I'm actually pretty impressed with it. It looks good. And from what we heard, it runs good too. So um, not bad. Definitely not as good as PS4 and Xbox One, I can tell. Uh, but still, it looks like the game is all intact there. The game is all intact. And, um, and yeah, it's going to be a good thing. So I'm definitely going to buy the game. I'm definitely going to buy it. I don't know if I'm going to play it like hardcore or anything, because Joker and everything. But, uh, but yeah, it's looking good. Not bad at all. Not bad at all. Let's see what some of the comments say here. Let's see, let's see what some of the people are saying. Um, let's see. Mortal Kombat 11 Nintendo Switch. This better be. Okay, this better be. Okay. Six frames per second with minimal, minimal graphical downgrade. You earn yourself a purchase. Katana speech on Baraka gave me goosebumps. Can't wait to play story mode. I've been uh, I've been waiting for this. Um, all it took was Johnny Cage serious to mess up his face. Uh, young Johnny. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so yeah. Uh, so yeah, everybody think, everybody's thinking it's looking pretty good. It's got 2.9 thousand likes and uh 19 dislikes so people are liking it people are thinking it's looking good i think it looks good like i said not as good as ps4 and xbox one but that's expected but that, that it's a quality it looks like a quality port based off of what we know what people played at uh pax and based off the what we saw right there it looks like a looks like a high quality port of the game so shout outs uh oh you're saying it was too gross now you're getting i'm gonna i'm glad no 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 no, no. it is too gross for me to play but even remember back when i said it i said that i said i'd buy the game but I didn't say I'm going to sit here and play. I just said right now I'm, I'm going to be doing Joker stuff. I'm going to buy the game for the culture. It's not because I want to play it. I said, I, But I already said even back then when I said it was too gross. It's too gross for me to play normally. But to be honest, I've been a little bit more desensitized to it. Because I've been watching it a lot more and watching it a lot more. But at the same time, I, it's not a game that I want to play. But will I buy it? Yeah, I'll buy it. Just because it's cool to have... I want to collect it. I want Mortal Kombat. This is the first Mortal Kombat in like 11 years. I want the game. Not that I want to play it. I think David Drayton, David Drayton is here. 
Uh, you know what I'm talking about. Like, I want I want to collect it. I want it, but I don't want to play it, if that makes any sense. But I want the box art. I want the cartridge because I think it's cool that Mortal Kombat comes on a cart. I mean, it's it's a partial download or, or it's like 15 gigabyte download, but with the cartridge. But it's cool that you can get Mortal Kombat on Nintendo system again. Like, it's been so long. So I grew up playing Mortal Kombat, man. So it's for the culture, bro. Uh, little Lucky Nick with the Twitch follow. Thank you so much. Welcome to the Fire Nation. Also, Cable9999 with the follow as well. Thank you so much, Cable. Welcome to the Ninja Village of Player Essence. Uh, yo, what's up, Chips and Sticks? How you doing today, my man? Um, does MK11 require a partial download? It, I just said that. Yeah, it does require a partial download. I said you have to download like 15 gigabytes. It's like a 15 gigabyte day one download. It's 8 gigabytes. like, Or they're using an 8 gigabyte cartridge and it's a 15 gigabyte download. Um, let's see here. Uh, Chips and Sticks doesn't matter if the mode turn off the blood and gore like the old ones. Does, uh, doesn't it have a mode to turn off the blood and gore like the old ones? It, it might. It might for the most part. But I mean, like, like I said, it doesn't, guys, it doesn't, at the end of the day, it doesn't matter. Who cares what I think when it comes to if I want to play, if it's too gory or not. I'm buying the game. So they're, they're going to get my, they're going to get my money regardless. It's going to count towards getting more games like this. Whatever you want to say, ulterior motives for people buying this game. I'm buying it for those reasons. So who cares if I, if I think it's too gory or whatever the case is. I don't really feel like playing it because I'm not a competitive Mortal Kombat player or anything like that. I'd rather get good at Smash Brothers because I do play locally here. I'm trying to get good and maybe I want to travel out to some tournaments and stuff, you know, at some point. Probably like if I can get to like a big tournament like later this year in the West, or, like here in the West Coast, maybe like so, like a two GG event, um, then I can do that. Um, but like I'm, I don't really feel like playing Mortal Kombat like that. I mean, I I'll, I might try it out, but I mean, it's just like I don't really care. You know, it's not like a big deal to me um, to play the game. But I'll buy it. I'll probably buy two copies and I'll probably give one copy away on the channel. We'll probably do a giveaway for one of the game. Well, yeah, we'll probably just do a giveaway when the game comes out. We'll have a giveaway. We'll have we'll, we'll put it together. I'll, I will make a Gleam giveaway on on Twitter and um whatever or i'll make a giveaway so we'll probably just do a giveaway for the game as well why not um uh, let's see here uh that story mode looks like fun the story mode's always good that's the thing that i kind of want to play is the story mode man um let's see here monkey voices i pre-ordered the co both copy on the eShop. says that i can play it on the 22nd the GameStop pickups on the 23rd on the ps4 okay Good stuff. Anthony Albert says that story. Okay, I already read that. Shadow King says I sort of fell off the Mortal Kombat fandom. I'm picking it up because I've uh, pretty much lost all interest in the Mortal Kombat franchise. Um, all right. Um, Got to buy Mortal Kombat uh, for that the Switch third party. Yeah, exactly. It's for the Switch third party support. It's for the fact that it's finally coming back. You know, Ed Boon really wanted this. I don't think this is a WB thing. I think this is an Ed Boon thing more so than anything. I really think this is an Ed Boon thing and not a WB. WB doesn't give a damn does not give a damn about the switch they just they just don't care you know what i'm saying they just don't care about the switch um so uh i think that ed boone really wanted it in my opinion i think that so then they got it done because ed boone has a lot of pull in terms of the platforms and what he wants to do you know and like where the games come because like he really i mean he wanted like injustice and stuff like on the vita you know like mortal Kombat. he wanted that stuff on the vita and like they got it you know so i think that's really what it comes down to yo what's up how outcast how are you doing today um is the stream running till Joker's out? No, the stream's not running till Joker's out. Uh, we're gonna go for about two hours. I'm gonna take a break, and then we're gonna be playing. Jo we're gonna be playing Joker all night. I I'm not trying to. I'm not trying to stream for that long because we're gonna be playing Joker for hours. So um, I'm gonna be labbing with Joker. I'm gonna be just trying out the new stages, looking at the, um, listening to the music, uh, labbing, just doing all sorts of stuff um, with Joker. So, so yeah. Um, Joker's not out yet, yet guys. Joker come. You guys, man, y'all bugging. Some of y'all bugging. Y'all don't watch none of the Y'all don't watch none of my content. Y'all bugging. I'm going to put this up here. I'm going to put this up here when Joker comes out. If anybody asks that question, I'm a freaking, I'm going to time him out anymore. Y'all bugging with this when's Joker out thing. Look, I'm going to let y'all know. I'm going to put it up right here. Don't time him out. You guys, you guys were too quick. You guys were too quick. There's nothing wrong with asking a question. He just, he probably just came in. He probably just came in, but look. Look.
All right. Joker is out. 8.30 p.m. ET. That's when Joker is out. You can clearly see it. It's right there. Joker is out. 8.30 p.m. ET. 8.30 p.m. ET. All right. So there we go. Um, Saul Vasquez says, um, I want MK11, but I feel like I um, I have a Doom situation where I won't play it. Um, I won't play it often enough. So, yeah. Um, uh, Pokemon is life says places. GameSpot just released a trailer showing MK11 on the Switch. It looks great. Can't wait until next Tuesday. Did you, If you just came in, we just reacted to that, my boy. We just reacted to that Pokemon is life. We, ju- we just reacted to that. So, yeah, I, I already know. We, saw, we just saw it. Um, I need to put that in the title before people just keep on coming in here saying, did you see the Mortal Kombat gameplay? 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 Like, <laughs> did you see the Mortal Kombat gameplay? Did you see the Mortal Kombat gameplay? Did you see the MK11 gameplay? Did you see the Switch MK11 gameplay? Did you see the gameplay? M- MK11 gameplay? MK11. <laughs> uh, David respects the hustle donated $20 with the Toby Becoming the top streaming to David Drayton, Double D, showing that support. Ambu Black Ops in the house and says, Sup, OJ? I thought I'd respect your time and hustle by paying you to answer obvious questions. One, when will Joker release? That's 8.30 p.m. PT, young man. Two, will you be playing as Joker when he releases? Yes, I will, sir. And three, oh, uh, three, Will you be doing a stream tonight? Absolutely, I'll be doing a stream tonight, David Respects the Hustle. And four, did you see the Switch Mini Leak? Absolutely, I saw it. It's not real, though, David. But thank you so much. I appreciate your donation. I really do, supporting the Ninja Village. And absolutely, hopefully we got all of your questions your questions answered very um, in a timely fashion. So thank you so much, man. I appreciate that. You guys give some love to Double D for the fantastic questions. Um, just and I'm so happy that I can answer that for you guys today. Honestly, seriously, like thank you guys so much and thank you, thank you, uh, David. I do appreciate, uh, I do appreciate that, man. I do appreciate it. And those were fantastic questions, you know. And and I think that they needed to be answered today. So yeah, absolutely. <laughs> thank you for the Toby Blaster, David. I appreciate that, man. <laughs> oh my God. All right, guys. Let me ask. Let me ask you guys a question. Um, let me ask you guys a question. Let me ask y'all, let me ask y'all a question. Y'all ready for the GameStop redemption run? You guys think GameStop can be saved? Can GameStop be saved? Here's a new policy from GameStop. Um, a new policy from GameStop. Um, NS... MK11 NS. Okay, hold up. Let me just make sure I fix this. GameStop Redemption, MK11 NS. All right, so GameStop, GameStop has a new policy where GameStop in the US has a new policy where you can actually return you can return games within 48 hours after the game's launch. So if you buy a brand new game after it launches, like let's say you buy Days Gone. You play Days Gone and it's not very good, you know, and you have 48 hours to return that game. Um, and, oh my God, yo, what is this? K-19 with the Toby Blister! Shout out to K-19, tying David Drayton as a top stream ninja. It says, yo, OJ, one question. Did you see the new MK11 gameplay on the Switch? Also, you getting it? Um, yes, young, young man, K19. Yes, young man, I definitely saw it. Um, I definitely saw the new Mortal Kombat 11 gameplay on the Nintendo Switch. And I'm absolutely, I'm going to get it. I'm getting it for the culture, my boy. So, yeah, absolutely. Thank you for the donation. I do appreciate it. And thank you for the fantastic question, by the way, because I'm pretty sure that that question is a lot of things that people really wanted to uh, to know and understand, you know, in terms of where I'm coming from. And I'm happy that I was able to answer that question for you, you know. Um, by, by the way, um, I also want to probably answer another question. Um, I, I'm probably thinking you're thinking, when's Joker going to come out? Joker from Persona 5. Um, it's going to be in Smash Brothers tonight by 8.30 p.m. ET, okay? 8.30 p.m. ET. Uh, so make sure you uh, get ready for that. So good stuff, man. Thank you so much, uh, K19. I appreciate that. That does tie you with David as the top stream ninja 
for today with the $20. So I appreciate that, man. You're also the stream boss as well. So shout outs. Right, let's go ahead and get your name up here on the leaderboard. Okay, 19. All right. All right, there we go. Get you guys both up on there. Let's go ahead and make this a little bit smaller so you guys can both fit. There you go. Um, I just saw your video on AI summoning files. And I'll definitely be keeping an eye on it. Yeah, it's coming out in July. July. GameStop can only be saved if they if the if used games are half the price of new games. Yeah, I don't know if used games need to be half the price of new games, but I mean it'd be nice. Um, so it's called like a uh, guaranteed to love it program where consumers can return a purchased game within 48 hours of the game's launch and they receive a full refund in the form of store credit, not including tax. The program is limited to $60 standard edition of new releases and any paid power up reward members bonuses will not apply. Um, the game can be powered, uh, can be opened and played. Um, it just has to be in good condition and must still have the receipt. So it's called the guaranteed to love it. And uh, you won't get your tax back, but you will get 60 bucks for the game. Um, and I honestly think that is going to be a big, personally, I don't know if it's going to save GameStop, but if they, if they initialize this, cause this is, um, GameStop is reporting it. It's not confirmed yet from GameStop, but they're saying that this is, it's going to happen. Um, sorry, GameSpot is reporting it. Um, but we haven't got an official confirmation, but if they do this, that's going to be really big because a lot of people are thinking, yo man, like if I don't like this game, I can return it within 48 hours. Even if I opened it. That's pretty cool. Like, I think more people start shopping at GameStop. That's one of the big problems with GameStop, right? We've seen people go in there and go nuts, right, about certain stuff, about certain games. Like Fallout, we've seen people do that with Fallout, uh, uh, was it Fallout 76 or whatever, you know? Um, and if they had this policy, then this that those, those freakouts and people getting crazy over things would have never happened. So I actually think that this is a good idea, and I think that this is going to get some more foot traffic into GameStop. It's actually... I mean, I'm not still on the boat. I'm not on the boat yet, but I mean, like, I, it's definitely got me thinking a little bit more. Got me thinking a little bit more. So, so yeah, man. Absolutely. Um, <coughs> uh, yo, Joker. When's when's Player Essence coming to? Uh, when's Player Essence coming to PlayStation All Stars? When's Player Essence coming to Player Essence? When's Player Essence coming to PlayStation All Stars? As soon as that game's that game's coming back. PlayStation All Stars Battle Royale Two. It's, it's going to be an exclusive on the Nintendo Switch. The Switch Mini. Um, Shadow King says, considering my recent experiences with GameStop, I don't believe they can be saved, especially when I show up to their store at the opening time and an hour after no one is there. Yeah, you know what? That actually happened to me when I bought... Okay, here's the thing. When I when I pre-ordered the Wii U back in the day, 2012, they said that the Wii, they said that they are, they are going to have the Wii U... They're going to have a midnight launch at the location. They said it's going to be a midnight launch, right? So I was like, all right, cool. And then they they didn't even let us know. I went there at midnight and the store was not open. They didn't even tell us. They they lied. The lady or they didn't know or whatever the case was. So then I was like, all right, whatever. So I saw the time that they opened in the morning. So then I went there in the morning, the time of the, the launch of the Wii U. So I, I was already pissed because I didn't get it at midnight like I wanted to. And then I went there in the morning and the lady was an hour late. And I was just like the same lady that told me that they had a midnight launch. And I'm like, this, this lady. And it's funny because that's the same lady who wouldn't take my PS3 at the other locations. Like she was just being, I, I just had multiple run-ins. And after that, I was like, I'm done with GameStop. I stopped, I stopped shopping there. Like I completely, like the last time that I shopped there, I bought Dragon Quest XI on the PS4 there. Because that's the only place that they had it. And they only, they had two copies. So, so yeah, man. Um... Let's see. They had such a hard time with around Fallout 76. Uh, that might actually be the reason they're implementing this policy. Well, I think it's also trying to save face too, because they're losing, they're losing, they're losing badly, like to Amazon and Best Buy and other places. So, so yeah. Uh, David Jordan wants to know uh, when is 8:30 p.m. ET for him locally. <laughs> I don't know where David lives. So, so yeah. Hey OJ, have you seen the trailer for NX, which is actually called the Nintendo Switch? It sounds like a unique concept for a console being a hybrid. Yeah, absolutely. Um, uh, I don't know where you live, David, and it's, and I don't want to say, you can tell us the, tell us the, the hemisphere, or tell us the time zone where you live, you know, or what part of the United States do you live in, then maybe I can tell you, but I, I don't know where you live, man. Um, shadow, oh, I already read that, um, see somebody getting blasted here in the chat, JJ, <laughs> getting blasted to smithereens, dude, Acme Acres. Uh, let's see here, uh, I think the return policy is a good start, but they need to be more aggressive on used pricing yeah absolutely 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 man um 
Let's see. If you're um if you're a grown man and you can't convert Eastern time, it, that's your own. Day. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, the GameStop near me is good. Or all right, guys. Here we go. Mods, mods. Don't time out people for asking the question. Just answer their question, okay? If if somebody if somebody truly comes into the stream and asks when's Joker or whatever, they, even though it says it literally says it right there. Um, just, just, just answer their question. Just answer their question. No more timeouts for people who are just asking. Um, it was more of a joke, more so than anything. I, I didn't think you guys were actually gonna start going through it. <laughs> going through it. Oh my gosh. Um, all right. So let's see. Kr deck it. I can't be the Hokage has to have a little bit of compassion. The Hokage needs to have just a little bit of compassion for. I feel. I feel. I feel bad right now. So let's just. <laughs> That's not, it was funny for a little bit. It's not, I don't know if it's a good right now. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, let's see here. There's just I can use my smartphone, but I've um but I haven't figured um out how. So I figure you'd magically know since you're OJ. <laughs> well, David, um I, I think you seem more like an East Coast guy, more so than a West Coast guy. So um so wait a minute, 8 30 p.m. ET. So you're not in that. So I mean if you're asking then you're not in the Eastern time zone, okay? So then I would think, I don't think you're a West Coast guy. I think you're, then you're a Central guy. So I think for you, it would come out at um, 7.30, 7.30 p.m. Central, right? Um, so I don't get to play Joker till tomorrow since uh, I work graveyard. The pain, the pain, the pain, um, the pain. This is following order. Yeah, they, they, those were my orders, guys. Just, yeah, no more. Just let them know what, just let them know what time it is. You know, let them know what time it is. Um, all right, so if you guys have questions on any of that, let me know. We can go ahead and move into random Q&A. We got through all the topics fairly quickly here. That's good. That's good. We got through four or five topics fairly quick. Oh, one more thing here, guys. Uh, Saints Row the Third. Saints Row the Third is actually getting, it's a GameStop exclusive here in the West. So Saints Row the Third, the full package. Um, if you if you're planning on playing this, um, let it be known that it is uh, a GameStop exclusive. Uh, there's not going to be many copies of this, and I'm gonna go. I'm, to be honest, I'm gonna go pick this up because I, I want all this crap. Um, you get a game, a game case sleeve. It just looks cool. I'm not even interested in Saints Row the Third too much. You got a double sided um, alternate in inlay, so it's double sided, so it's gonna look nice when you open it up. You get some what is it? Some console sticker sheets. You get some thumb grips. You get a double-sided poster, you get a microfiber screen cloth, and you get a lithographs, double-sided lithographs with some of the characters. Um, so out May 10th, I'm picking it up because it looks cool. Playing it, so that's the only reason why I'm buying this because it looks cool. Am I, I going to play it? Probably not, but it looks it looks really cool. This is the freaking Spawn Wave edition, dude. This <laughs> Saints Row the 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 the, the, the full Spawn Wave deluxe pack, dude. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Um, all right, so there you go. Um, so there you go. Give away your copy for free. No, I just said that I want to collect it. What kind of what the hell? I just said I want I want to I want I want the cartridge too. That would be give away the give away. No. The whole point was me collecting it. That, I mean, if you don't have the cartridge and that's that's the that's the issue. I need the cartridge as well. You got you guys go buy it. If you want this, you want all this crap, go buy it. I'm already giving away Mortal Kombat. Um, but anyway, there you go. I'm not giving away mine. What the hell? <laughs> I'll give away Mortal Kombat, though. Um, all right. So, that's that. Um, Spawn Wave, Spawn Wave the third. <laughs> Does that one cost more? Yeah, I think it's going to be 60. I think it's going to be 60 bucks. Or no, no, no. It's going to be 40 bucks. No, wait, let me, let me double check. Not 64. It's going to be, let me double check on the price. 39, 39.99, 39.99 for it. Yeah, it's, it's confirmed 39.99. Yeah, it's confirmed, confirmed 39.99. Um, so there you go. Um, is there stream lag, Jazzy? You said this, the, the, the stream lag is bad? Um, if there's stream lag, uh, refresh your stream if you're having stream lag. Um, out of the blue. Okay. Let me see. Maybe it's because we have too many um, too many windows open. 
and stuff. So let's close out some stuff, shall we? Okay, so maybe that, that should reduce it. If you're having stream lag, just hit the refresh button. Let me... Oh, I'm having stream lag too. Yeah, my CPU is being taxed, taxed the hell out of, out of nowhere for some reason. I don't know what's going on. Yeah, for some reason, my CPU is just going, it's just going nuts. Yeah, it's just my CPU is just going absolutely nuts right now. I don't know why. It just is. Hold up. Oh no, it's not time for a new CPU. My CPU is fine. It, it there's there's obviously some type of error or something. Um. Hmm. Uh, a bunch of skipped frames. I, there's obviously some type of error or there's something wrong. I'm not really sure. Huh. I don't know why. Is there something? Sorry guys, let me do a little bit of a uh, let me do a little bit of um, maintenance real quick. Let me know in the chat how if you got if it's still having issues, guys. All right. My CPU is fine. It's never. It's not supposed to be like this. That's the thing, Hunter. It's not supposed to. There's some type of error going on. It's not supposed to be like this. I usually only use like maybe like 15% of the CPU. It's not supposed to. It's not time for me to switch. It's just there's some, there's, a, there's obviously an error. <clears throat> okay. Uh, I'm fine right now, but it's all... Um, I'm fine with all-out all attack at this point. Okay. Let me know, guys. Is, is there any issues uh, at this point? Are you guys still having any issues with the, with the stream? Exit out of that. I'm good. It only lagged during the transition. Okay, maybe the transition caused the caused that type of lag. Okay. Well, sorry about that, guys. Um, I will look at maybe optimizing some things. I see that I am dropping some few frames, but it looks like everything's back. Um, looks like everything everything is back. So there you go. Um, all right. My voice is muffled. Hmm. This is interesting. Let me double check. I don't know what's going on. All right. How about now? It's freezing a lot. Yeah, guys. I don't... I don't know. I don't know. Some people are having issues. Some people aren't. If you're having issues, just refresh the stream. Refresh the stream again if you're having issues. I'm just going to continue as if there's nothing wrong because some people are having issues and some people aren't. So if you're having issues, refresh the stream. If you're not, I mean, if uh, go over to my Twitch channel too. So uh, head over to Twitch um, and you might be able to watch it better. So, um, so I do have a Twitch channel and it seems like I'm looking at my Twitch and everything's running good. Everything's running good on, on Twitch. So... So there you go. Go over to my Twitch channel if you're having issues. Um, all right, Fairy Tiger donated a one dollar donation, um, and he says 3 a.m. CET for Joker. Guess it's time for bed. LOL. Three hours sleep, then game, then game on. Play something uh, Smash slash Persona. All right, man. Thank you so much, Fairy Tiger. I appreciate that. And uh, yeah, man, that's pretty rough. Pretty rough for uh, for you guys over there. Um, It's saying that there's only 16 people watching the stream. All right, let me double check. This might be a YouTube game. This might be a YouTube thing too, guys. This might be YouTube servers acting crazy because it seems like Twitch. Hey, Twitch boys, is everything is everything looking okay on Twitch? Twitch boys. Um, so this might be a YouTube thing, guys. Might be a YouTube thing. Um, no, it doesn't say that. Looks like everything's good here. Looks like everything's good on my end. 
Um, so... Let me know how the music sounds, guys. Uh, shout outs to K19 with the 34 bits. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. Thank you for the bits. Uh, also, shout outs to Robert. He says, yo, OJ, just a little song request. Alundra Symphonic Suite, Viking Nation. All right, no problem, Robert. We'll definitely get that going for you. As long as it's not copyrighted. <laughs> Thank you, Robert, for the $2 donation. Co-captain of the Viking Nation, Robert. Give me some love to the village with the shimmy. Thank you, guys. Appreciate that. Um... I wish they'd also give us uh, Burn My Dread from Persona 3. It was one of the uh, favorite songs from that game. Bruh. Bro, just be happy we're getting just be happy we're getting what we're getting, man. Um yeah, like I'm looking at I'm looking at it and like You guys head over to Twitch. Head over to Twitch if you're having issues. Um I can't wait for Cuphead to, uh, Cuphead switch tomorrow. Uh mods link link my Twitch channel. YouTube's having some issues. If you're having issues, go to Twitch. Don't complain in the YouTube chat. Just go to Twitch if you're having issues. Because I, I can't fix I can't fix it what you, what YouTube's doing. Twitch, everybody's saying Twitch is good. So go over to my Twitch channel if you're if you're having issues. And I can see all your comments on Twitch too. So don't worry. All right, so that's the last time I'll address it. Mods, you guys can take care. Like, if somebody asks, like, if they're having issues, just let them know. Let them know um, that Twitch is better. Or that Twitch, it's it's working well on Twitch. It's lagging here, to be honest. It's lagging there on Twitch, too? Uh-oh, that might, that might be a thing here. Uh-oh. That's something I got to look into after the stream is done. All right. Um, let's see here. So, for those who aren't having issues, I'm just going to continue on. If you're having issues, that's unfortunate. But there's, I don't think there's anything that I can do. I don't think, I don't really think there's anything I can do at this point because I don't know what's going on because everything was working fine yesterday and today. I think there's just some issue with my, um, probably with my, uh, my software. Oh, hold up. Probably, probably with my software that I'm like my, my plugin software that I'm using. So I think that's probably what's going on here. What's, what's causing some of the issues. So I gotta, I gotta take a look at that and the transitions and everything that i'm using and then we'll we'll take we'll fix it tomorrow completely um so uh so yeah so if you guys are having issues sorry about that guys i can't fix it um but uh we'll we'll, we'll probably what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna cut the stream off just a little bit early today just so i can make sure that i fix the issues for uh for the stream tonight um let's see here what's your prediction of, uh so if you guys have questions feel free to tag me at player essence or hashtag player essence um, so yeah, let me know. Um, let's see, Fairy Tiger donated don another $2 and says, Oh, Cuphead is tomorrow. Almost for, um, LOL, almost forgot about that one. Uh, preloaded a, a week ago. Nice. Also, shout out to Neosonic124. Thank you so much for the Twitch follow. Welcome to the Fire Nation. Yeah, thank you, Fairy Tiger, for the donations, man. I, I really appreciate that. I really, really do, man. Um, so yeah. Um, Dick Beep says, uh, What's your prediction on how many Joker will you run in Smash? online and a smash will get a sale boost of course smash is going to get a sale boost but i mean like how many jokers i'll run into online probably a lot um probably a lot <clears throat> uh let's see here cuphead is so hard yeah cuphead it's a bit difficult it's a bit difficult um all right let me go ahead and move on to the next song here it's just muscle memory, though. Once you remember some of the stuff, it's easy to beat. Or it's e it gets easier. Symphonic Sweet. All right. All right, here we go. Alundra, Symph Alundra Symphonic Sweet. Um, let's see. I, I will be playing as Joker in my, squad in, in my squad car tonight at work. Nice, Alucard. Nice. Um, Andy Mine says, hey, have you talked about the other uh, guests about having me on the podcast yet? Or did you forget? Yeah, I've already talked about it. I mean, there's Andy, there's no way that we can do it that early because people have work, you know, so there's no way that we can get it that early because it'd be it'd be it'd be too early for everybody else because they do it after work. So that'd be the unfort that's that's the unfortunate thing with doing it like that early, like, you know, two o'clock my time or three o'clock. So. Um, so, yeah. Um.
<laughs> I'm not answering any of you guys' Joker questions. So tag me at Player Essence or hashtag Player Essence um, if, uh, if you guys have any other questions. I'm not, I'm not answering like when Joker's coming out questions. Like I'm not answering any of those. So uh, feel free to ask. Feel free to waste your time. Um, yeah, I'll be, I'll be working. I'll be streaming. I'll be streaming tonight once Joker comes out. Yeah. Um, Andy Mine says, um, well, I'm not staying up till 2 a.m. Another, uh, another chance wasted. Yeah, I'm sorry about that, Andy. It's just like, I can't, I mean, we, we wouldn't have anybody else on the podcast. It would just be me and you. Um, this song is Alundra Symphonic Suite. It was requested by, um, by, uh, Robert from the Viking Nation. Uh, what do I think about Stage Builder? Oh, I think Stage Builder is really cool. I'm, I'm glad that they're adding it back in. Definitely glad that they're adding it back in. Fairy Tiger donated two dollars and says, "Oh, and Robert, you better come here tomorrow. LOL. Need to play Cuphead while drinking coffee and my PE mugs. LOL. Viking Nation, play something Xenoblade. Shoutouts, man. Thank you so much. <laughs> Shoutout. Thank you. Appreciate that, Robert. Or sorry, appreciate that, Fairy Tiger. Robert, get over to his house. So you guys can play some Cuphead. Um, the stream will be right when Joke when Joker comes out, guys. We'll be streaming when Joker comes out. Um." Let's see, any news on MK11? Uh, yeah, we already talked about, there's a, there's a trailer out for MK11 on the Switch. So, just go on YouTube, the official Nintendo page, just type in Mortal Kombat 11 Switch trailer and you'll see it. So yeah, it's already, it's already, it's, uh, they got a trailer out, so there you go. Um, why does every, Kirby Mason says, why does everybody hate Smash Tour? Um, Smash Tour, because it's stupid and it barely makes sense. Uh, dozens of unique geese, thank you for the Twitch follow, appreciate that, man. Welcome to the Fire Nation. Um... Richard Taku saved the world says a uh, player since fake switch mini original post got deleted on the Chinese website. Okay, it got deleted on the Chinese website. Got it. Got it. And I already knew it was fake. That's why I said I already knew it was fake. Geronimo says, as someone who plays quick play on online a lot, who do you expect to get some nerfs and buffs since the balancing team seems to use online modes a lot? Well, they use Elite Smash to help balance. Um, and I think that Wolf's Blaster is going to get nerfed. I don't know what else is going to happen. I think Sheik is going to get a, a light, slight buff. I think Little Max is going to get a buff. Kirby's going to get a buff. I think, like, Zelda could get a buff. I think um, Richter and Simon might be able to get a buff. Um, I think... Who else? I think, like, DK. I think there's going to be a lot of characters that get a little bit of a buff. So, yeah. Uh, let's see. Shadow King says, Do you think Hollow Knight Silk Song will get a physical release? I was wondering since I'm picking up the physical edition for the first game at the end of the day. Of the end of May. I think eventually it'll get a physical release, yeah. Yeah. Um... Thoughts on video editor coming to Smash? It's cool, Battlefront X. I, I like the fact that they're having it in there for easy video editing. So, yeah, that's cool. That's also cool. Um, what's Smash Tour? Smash Tour is a mode that was in Super Smash Bros. Uh, for Wii U. It was like a board game thing that I think Sakurai and Bandai Namco made when they were when they were drinking. Like, they were having drinking, like, sake. And they, were, they were, like, drinking, and they made that mode. I, I don't know what that mode is just... I don't know what that mode is. It's just a really weird mode in Smash Smash for Wii U. Corn and Greninja need buffs. I think Corn definitely needs a buff. Greninja, he can use a buff, but I mean I don't think he needs it. But I think Corn needs a buff. Corn's Corn's fair should kill at higher percentages. It doesn't kill. Corn's up air kills, but his fair should kill. We need another subspace. I don't know if we need another subspace, but it'd be nice. Um, let's see, mementos. What about mementos, Suzumi? Su it's Suzumiya. Suzumiya. What about it? Um, who's my main? My main is Goku. Goku's my main. Um, let's see here. J2 Blue says, um, "Do you think Paul Tana will get a buff? Paul Tana? No, I don't think Paul Tana will get a buff. Yeah, this this song's actually pretty dope." Um, Goku me, no, actually Goku from like Super Saiyan Goku from Dragon Ball Z, not Goku me. Super Saiyan Goku's my 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 main in the game. Super Saiyan Goku is in is in Smash Brothers. He's my main. Um, not the not the me. Me fighters are dumb. I don't use me fighters. Um, my girl Paul Tana is fine. Don't touch her. I mean, if she got a buff, that'd be good. But I don't think she's gonna get a buff. She's already a a tier character, so. 
Um, I'm not going to say your name, but I'll answer your question. It says, do you have any advice on beating a Donkey Kong main? Uh, beating a Donkey Kong main? Yeah, be patient. Be patient against Donkey Kong players. Um, they got big hitboxes. So, I mean, you can usually combo them. So look, to tr try to rack up the damage on Donkey Kong mains. And then really try to um, just be patient. Don't run into silly things, you know, that they can do. Because Donkey Kong is really strong. Um, get ready to mash because Donkey Kong, Donkey Kong players are going to want to grab you. Um, so just be ready to slip dodge. Be ready to be ready for that grab. You know, just be be ready for it. You know. Um, let's see. Do you think they should add taunting for online and Smash? No, they shouldn't add taunting because there's no there's no need to there's no need to taunt somebody online. Um, Battlefront X says, do you think uh, Captain Falcon needs a nerf? No, he needs a buff. I feel like he's kind of um, underwhelming. Um, and slow with his moves. Okay, so I don't. I think you meant buff. You said, do you think Captain Falcon needs a nerf? Nerf is bad. And then you went on to say he's kind of underwhelming. So I think you meant buff. Um, yeah, I think he needs a little bit of a buff. Yeah, that'd be nice. Yeah, you meant buff. Yeah. Yeah. Um, thanks for, yeah, just look out for the grabs. Just look out for the grabs, man. Um, why, though? Taunting is part of the game. Yeah, part of the game when you're playing with your friends, yeah, taunting's part of the game. But there's nothing that there's nothing that taunting does that gives you any type of advantage or disadvantage. So there's no reason to taunt somebody online. There's literally no reason to taunt somebody online. <clears throat> so if you're worrying about taunting, you should be worrying about winning the match, not worrying about taunting somebody online you don't know. That's stupid. There's no need for it. There's no need to taunt. Um... If you want to teabag, you can teabag. Go ahead and te if you want to teabag somebody, taunting teabag, whatever. But there's no, there's really no need. Um, there's no need to taunt somebody. It does nothing. It doesn't and help the game or anything like that. It's just, it's just your own mind, somebody's own mindset of doing something for no, for absolutely no reason. It, it's, it's useless. Lu Luigi's one character in the game. There's like 80 characters or whatever. There's like 77 characters. You, get to, you guys mentioned one person. Um. TCRX says, thanks for the Saints Row update. No problem. Um, what do I think about the new update? Yeah, I've already talked about it multiple times, uh, Lazy Bones uh, XX. Uh, make sure you guys subscribe for those who are asking me questions that I don't see here often. I don't know if you guys are subscribed or anything, but make sure you guys subscribe and watch my videos because I've already talked. I literally put my live reaction to it, and I also did a video this morning. I mean, so if you've just – and I streamed yesterday – so, I mean, if you haven't seen my reaction to it, I mean, I don't know what's going on. Maybe you're not looking. But either way, um, my reaction's already up on the channel. My react, my live reaction and my thoughts on the update in terms of what I think. I don't want to spend too much time repeating the same things over and over that we already talked about like multiple times in videos. And I already talked about even in this own live stream. But I think I like it. It's looking good. The update 3.0 is looking really good. Um, do I think Pac-Man should get a buff or a nerf? I think Pac-Man should get a turf. It's somewhere in be it's 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 not a buff or a nerf. It's a turf. It's one of those. It's in between. Um, let's see here. A player says, "What does tech mean?" I've been hearing the word in Smash community, never knew what it means. There's a couple things that it means. It means that somebody's discovering new tech or different types of things that you can do in the game to exploit or take advantage of it. Or it can mean like tech, as in somebody like when you fall down like you can press the shield button at the same time as soon as you hit the ground and you tech that's called a tech or if you get hit off of a wall that's also called it like and you press the shield button right before you hit the wall that's also called a tech it softens the blow so you don't like slam off of it and you know go down or you can tech roll you can roll to the left or to the right once you hit the ground or when you tech you get right back up so that's what tech means um <clears throat> Even when you even when you put it literally right there on the screen, people still people still will ask like you can't even put stuff on the screen and people will still ask the question. Murdoch Loco says, players, it's okay, random question. I know the Viking Nation origins, but who falls under the Fire Nation? Um I have I just wondered Twitch. Anybody who's on Twitch, that's the Fire Nation. Viking Nation is anybody that's from like Sweden, that area over there. Um and then the uh, regular village here is player essence. So that's just yeah. Um the Elite Ninja Village is just right here. Um, yeah, it's like literally on the screen. I mean, at this point, I mean, I, I think I should probably do, I sh maybe I should just do this. I mean, with this just, I mean, like, is just, is this something that would just, you guys just want me to like, is this probably something that I should do that's better? So we can just make sure that everybody just know, um, knows what's going on. 
you know, like, I think at this point, like, maybe this would probably be the best option to do, you know, because, I mean, some people literally are not even, like, they're not even looking at the screen. Like, I'm not, they're not even watching the stream. They're just in the chat. <laughs> uh, so, so, I mean, I think, it, it, can, can we all see? Can we all see here? Is everybody, is everybody okay with this here? Um, so, yeah, we'll just go ahead and do this. We'll, we'll just go ahead and do this. There's no way you can miss it at this point. Um, let's see here. Um, <laughs> some sirens and flashing lights. Yeah, man. Like, we're, 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 you know what I'm saying? Like, that's what we need. That's what we need. All right, guys. Um, keep the, keep the questions coming. If you have questions, I got answers for you. Um, and the only reason why, Jackie, that anytime you, you ask a question, I've been, I've been trolling a little bit is because you were trolling me earlier with a bunch of stuff that you were asking. So you troll me, I'll troll you back. Um, you ask legit, I mean, I see that you're starting to ask more legit questions now, so maybe I'll answer them more truthfully or just normally, but uh, yeah, that's the whole thing. So, so yeah. Um, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I'm not even, I'm not even going to sit here and, uh, I'm not even going to sit here and answer anything like that. When people say, I thought it was, I thought it was five, five fifty. It wasn't. So that's the time. Um, uh, will Joker be OP? No. Why would Joke? Why is Joker going to be OP based on what? Are you getting Cuphead on the Switch, Arash? I already have Cuphead on the Switch. I I also played it on the channel. I've talked about it multiple times, Arash. <clears throat> I've talked about it on multiple streams. I've talked about it on that. I already have. The, I've uploaded videos. I've live streamed it. That's well, I think you're here a lot, but then you ask me questions that are like, you ask me like, sometimes you ask me questions that are like, you're not, you're not looking at all. I get it. You guys can't always watch every single video, but at least look at the video pages. At least, at least look, at least look, at least look for those who come here all the time, at least look. But yeah, I've, I've talked about it multiple times. I have the game already. I've, I've had the game for like over a week. Um, let's see here. Bottle Dirtfish says, what DLC fighters would you like to see? No predictions or anything, just your fantasy picks. Fantasy picks? Um, Chrono. Chrono from Chrono Trigger. Um, who else? Um, <laughs> Naruto. <laughs> it's never going to happen, but like Shippuden Naruto. Um. Uh, I'm trying to think of like my ultimate fantasy picks. Um. Hmm. Like probably like a Resident Evil character, like a Leon S. Kennedy. Leon S. Kennedy, yeah, Leon S. Kennedy. Um, who else? Fantasy picks. Any more fantasy picks that I can think of? Uh, I think that's it. I think that's it, man. Um, that's it. Damn, you guys, you guys banned him? Hmm. So yeah, that's it. Man, you got banned already. All right. Well, thanks for coming out to the stream, Elliot Fogg. <laughs> That's a weirdo name. Thank you, man. Thanks for coming out to this. Thank you for the view. Appreciate it. <laughs> um, Goku. I don't want Goku. Um, okay, sorry. I need to limit the questions. Feel stupid. Sorry, annoy you. No, you're not. You're not annoying me. I'm just gonna let you know that like you don't need to limit the questions. You can ask the questions, but like. You should at least just check the page. Like you said, oh well, are you gonna get Cuphead? Well, it's like I've already, we've already talked about that. I mean, even in streams that I know that you've been here, I've literally talked about me playing Cuphead while you're here. That's the thing. Like I've already talked about it multiple times. Like in multiple streams that you've been here. That's all. Um, there's been seven you're done's and three bands today so far. Yo, uh, for goodness gracious, yo, a lot today, dude. A lot, a lot of, a lot today. I don't know what's going on, man. I don't know. I think it's because of the. We're getting a lot more. We're getting a lot more people to subscribe and everything, and a lot more people to get come in here. So sometimes you, some of the some of the weirdos come through. 
Um, they, a lot of people don't expect them to actually get attention, though. That's the thing. A lot of people don't expect them. Like they don't they don't expect them to get attention. So, but um, just just next time for the uh, dank meme. Next time, uh, just time him out and then give him a warning. I think that was a I think that was a little too fast on that. Um, a little a little too fast on, on the on the ban. So uh, just next time, I'm gonna unhide him. But um, just a timeout next time if you feel that he's being disrespectful because I didn't originally see his comments. So just next time, a little, a little timeout. Um, let's see here. Um, VC says a lot of Joker came. Uh, a lot of Jokers came out to play. Okay, <laughs> oh, that nice little play on the words there. Um, let's see. Hey, do you know when it'll release specific standard time? I think I think that's how you say it. I, German Ortiz, I think it's time for you to. I think it's time for you to learn time zones, my, my boy. That's what I'm going to tell you. I think it's time for you to learn time zones. If if you don't know your time zones, it's time to learn them. So um so yeah, go ahead and use that internet. Type in, type type in 8:30 p.m. ET to Pacific time or whatever time you want it to go. And I, I think it's time. I think it's about time you learn some time zones, my boy. Or or you can simply use the power of your smartphone. There's lots of cool things that you can do with these smartphones. You know, uh, a lot of times with these smartphones, you can. Um, you can find out time zones. They have apps that you can go on there to know what time. Like for example, I can tell you guys right now, with the with the touch of a of a button on my clock, my clock app, I can find out what time it is instantly in Stockholm, Sweden. It's twelve oh five a.m. in Sweden. In Melbourne, Australia, it is eight oh five a.m. in Melbourne, Australia. I know what time it is in London. In London right now, it is eleven oh five. PM. I know what time it is in 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 Africa in Nigeria too. It's 11:05 p.m. in Nigeria as well. So I mean, these are things that you can instantly that you can use the power of the internet to simply find out things that are very simple things for you to find out. Um, you're gonna learn today. Um, let's see here. So shout outs to Iron Destruction with the subscription. Also shout outs to Sis and Bro hashtag Gaming with the subscription as well. Thank you guys so much. Welcome to Elite Ninja Village of Player. I still appreciate you guys being here. Hopefully you guys enjoy the stream. Um, hopefully you guys enjoy it. Let's see here. What, <laughs> what time is it in a time machine? What time is it in a time machine? Hmm, I'm not really sure. Get a time machine, then I'll let you know. Uh, what, what ancient, uh, what ancient alien technology are you talking about, OJ? Seriously, man. Um, seriously. <laughs> Let's see what the technology we're using at this point. Ignorance is a choice. It's pretty much, yeah, it's pretty much a choice. You know, it's pretty much a choice. Um, I bet nobody just now to show your phone telling them like that. Ask what time Joker drops in a few minutes. Well, I should have known that if I put 8.30 p.m. PT, like uh, p.m. ET, people will ask, well, what time is it in my time zone? You know, which you should not be. Anybody over the age of like 10 should know time zones. If you're over the age of 10, you should know time zones. Like I think even younger than that. But like that's about when I learned time zones was eight to 10 years old. I didn't understand time zones before that, but around, by the time I was 10 years old, I knew what time zones were. And I knew at least here in the US, like Central, Eastern, West Coast time. You know what I'm saying? Like I knew about that. Now I learned other stuff like Hawaiian and other things like that. I learned those later. Um, and even like overseas times, I learned those way later, you know, but I mean, in, if you're here in the US, you shouldn't be asking, well, what time is it in, 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 in PM in my time or what time? Like that's, that's, that's absolutely ridiculous. That's asinine that you would not know a time that you don't know time zones. It doesn't, if you're over the age of 10, if you're over the age of 10, that's ridiculous. Um, shout outs to shadow two, two, uh, two, two, six, six with the, with the Twitter follow. And, he, uh, thank you so much. Welcome to the fire nation homie. Appreciate that. Um, why don't you hang those cool posters? Why don't I not hang the cool posters? No, I don't hang the posters because I don't want to, to be honest. Because I'm I'm gonna be redesigning the room anyway, so there's no point in hanging them when they're just gonna they're just gonna come down later anyway. So yeah. Um, what Mortal Kombat character would you want in Smash? I don't want any Mortal Kombat characters in Smash. Um, Juan Castillo says, can you please explain what the te a tethered recovery is in Smash? That's how uh, that's how you say. It. Yeah, it's anybody who has like some type of like whip or some type of thing that they can use to recover for example like you know simon and richter like when you see them like using their whip to latch onto the ledge and recover that that's a tether recovery um or a tether grab you know um like luigi's vacuum you know poltergeist thingy or whatever it is uh zero suit samus has like a little like electric whip or whatever it is or i don't know what it is <laughs> you know plasma whip you know those are that's that's a tether, that's a tether recovery people that can do that um lucas has like that snake that's a tether. He can tether recover with that tether grab as well. So yeah, that, that's what a tether recovery is. Uh, Samus with the grappling beam, exactly. Samus with the grappling beam. That can also be a tether recovery as well. So, 
So yeah. Um. Wait. Oh wait. Can Samus's can Sam can Samus's grappling hook re recover tether? I I don't really see people do it in Smash Ultimate. Can it? Any Samus mains in here? Can it actually recover? I know Zero Suit Samus can, but I don't know about like regular Samus. It might be able to. Um. Uh, actually, Link cannot tether with the hook shot. Link no longer. If you're talking about regular Link, regular Link no longer has that. I think if you're talking about you talk about Toon Link, Toon Link, yeah, or Young Link, one of those two. Okay, both Samuses can. Okay, well there you go. M most Samuses don't use it though. There's no point. Samus already has a good. Samus has a good recovery, so I, I just don't see Samus players use it very often. Um. So yeah. Regular, regular Link doesn't have a tether recovery anymore. He used to, though. Not anymore. Re regular Link has a, has a normal grab, which is good. Which is good. Yo, shout out to the, Al the Alpha Wolf 124 with the subscription. Thank you so much, the Alpha Wolf. Do appreciate you being here. Welcome to the Ninja Village of Player Essence. Hopefully you enjoy your, uh, enjoy your stay here. Katana Zero or Cuphead, Player Essence. Uh, I need to play Katana Zero first before I tell you that. Um... Psychopaths, did you talk about the Switch Mini yet? Yeah, I already did. There was a fake, there was a fake Chinese, uh, fake Chinese uh, leak that some came out about the Switch Mini. It looked dumb. It wasn't. There wasn't actual. It's not. It's not real. And the site deleted it. But yeah, it's not. It's not real. It looked like a, like a laser printer or somebody just making a joke. But it was like a Switch Mini shell, a fake Switch Mini shell that we already debunked. Um. Link clones referring to Young Link and and Tune. Okay, well, yeah, you, you just said Link. You got to make sure that you say which ones that 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 because like there's Link, Young Link, and then Tune Link. You know, and regular Link doesn't have a doesn't have a tether recovery. He just has a regular. Well, his recovery is kind of bad, but I mean, at least there's hitboxes, right? You said oh, okay. You originally said Link clones. Oh yeah, you're right. You're right. I'm actually wrong on that. You did say Link clones, but the thing that the, I think the reason why. I said that Link doesn't have those aren't really clones. Um, regular Link isn't Toon Link isn't a clone of regular Link. They actually operate very differently, and Young Link actually operates differently from Toon Link. So they're actually not clones. So that's the thing. I mean, they have similar move sets, but Ryu isn't a clone of Ryu's not a clone of uh, of Ken, and Akuma is not a clone of Ryu or anything like that. So they they actually have different things. So that, I think that's what threw me off a little bit. But you're right. You did say Link clones, but Link. Link, Toon Link, and Young Link aren't clones. That's the thing. Um, they're not even Echoes. Um, so, yeah. Uh, they're still Links. Yeah, but they're not clones, though. <laughs> That's the thing, though. They're not clones. They're not clones or Echoes. Um, they're not even, like, the same height. They don't even look the same. Like, regular Link looks is tall and looks different from Toon Link. Toon Link is completely drawn differently. And Young Link looks like the Ocarina of Time. They're all from, like, different, like, whatevers, you know? Um, Toon Link and Young Link are two of my favorites. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <sighs> oh my gosh! I it literally says the time. It literally says the time, and people just still. Um, it literally says the time. Joker is out at, at that. Joker comes with update three point So it literally says it right across the screen. Um. <laughs> I, I told you, I, I, I mean, like, it, it, I don't know how more, how much more I can do it, dude. Like, it, it, <laughs> oh my gosh, dude. Um, let's see here. Um, the links are similar, and I have, and I'll have Link in their names, so I call them clones. Okay, yeah, that's that's fine, Jackie, and that, that that's cool. I, I mean, that that's cool, but I mean, like, you just gotta be careful with that because. Like, you know, in competitive Smash, and like for most people who play the game, if you call them clones, they'll be like, that's, they're not clones, you know, because they're, they are they are actually very, very different in terms of how they play. Like Young Link can do a bunch of things that Toon Link can't do, and Normal Link can do a bunch of things that Normal Link or that Young Link can't do. And like they're all, I mean, like I said, they, they have similar movesets, but they're all actually kind of different. Like some of their combos and what works, what doesn't work, you know, they're and like how they're, they're like, for like, for example, to, um, Toon Link, has a uh, completely different forward smash. It, it, it's completely different from from young uh, from the other the other links, you know, from from that, and also like how their bombs work. For example, you know, regular link he has remote bombs, which is a completely different 
edge i mean that can that can be like the make or break between if you play this character between other ones like the edge guarding with regular link is so much more potent because he can throw bombs off stage like that and like detonate them when he wants to like the setups um like how their boomerangs even work like um even like how the arrows work like young link can shoot you with multiple arrows and it combos you up and they're fire they're fire arrows so it, it puts that property on them so i mean and even like young link some of his combos and how those work like tilts and like the down airs too the down air like the, the amount of lag ending lag between like toon links down air and regular links down air i mean there's so many change there's so many differences between them like i don't like using toon link or young link but i like using regular link you know so i mean so i mean i, I get what you're saying like you know that's how you're, you're talking to uh, talk about it, but we just got to be you know careful in terms of how it is competitively but yeah i see i see what you're saying no, i I'm, i don't disagree with you per se um i don't even i don't even really think that they're semi clones i think that they're I think that they're just they're they're different they're completely different. I mean they're they're just different. I personally for me, but I'm a competitive player. If you're a non-competitive player, then yeah, they would seem similar. But if you're a competitive player, they're very different. You know, somebody who uses Toon Link doesn't mean that they're going to be good with regular Link. If you use Toon Link, doesn't mean you're going to be good with with Young Link. If you use Young Link, doesn't mean you're going to be good with with um with the regular Link. So I mean, as a competitive standpoint. However, if you're more of a casual, then absolutely they're very they're very similar. So I can see why you know you you think that um let's see here my combos as young link are ferocious with the uh, dares and the fairs and there's bears there's fairs there's bears trares and there's there's young link has ridiculous frame data he does two link has some good frame data too but i think two links probably the weakest the weakest weakest out of the three um, in my opinion i think it's i personally feel now other people disagree but i think it's link young link than Toon Link in that order. However, I think you can change Young Link and, to, and regular Link. I think you can interchange them in terms of who's better because uh, Young Link has some pretty nasty combos. But I just love being able to throw a bomb and de like that bomb can kill. That His detonation bomb kills. That's the thing that makes Toon Link like very, very deadly is that, that if you throw it off stage and he hits you with that, that bomb can kill you off the side of the stage. I mean, sometimes it throws you up in a different direction. But I mean, that bomb can kill you and it's a ridiculous edge guarding tool, you know? It just makes people do things. It makes you recover. Diff it, it changes your game plan so much, you know? Um, let's see here. Um, TC says, uh, will you be playing the next Splatfest in Splatoon 2? I know that game kind of got ruined by the, with the hacking. Yeah, the game kind of got ruined with the hacking for me. Um, from what I understand, though, it seems like a lot of people are saying that, I mean, they're getting back into it. Um, will I try it out? I might try it out. I think probably, like, the last... The thing that I know that I'm going to do 100% is, like, the last event for Splatoon, like, the last major event for Splatoon before they stop doing major events like Splatfest, I know I'll play that for sure. I know... Oh! <laughs> I know why my stream has been lagging. <laughs> oh, my gosh. I'm silly. <laughs> So, um, do you guys remember when we watched the Mortal Kombat 11 trailer and I said, I'm going to, let's do my live reaction. I'm going to record it. <laughs> Looks like I forgot to hit the stop record button on there. <laughs> no, it's not a bad window. It was literally the record button. I was recording when you re when you stream and you record at the same time, it puts it puts a lot of strain on your computer. No matter what, if you're recording at like eight, like because like I record at 1080p footage, you know. So when I record it, it's at 1080p. So streaming, doing the stream, which is a 1080p stream, also while recording high quality audio, while there's a lot of stuff going, like graphics and stuff like that going on. That's the reason why things got janked. It was because of that. I totally forgot to hit the stop the record button. So everything that I've been saying since the Mortal Kombat 11 thing has been being recorded uh so so yeah that's that's <laughs> and now when i do that my cpu drops all the way down to uh to to 20 20 percent all the way down so yeah omega 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 lol omega lol so yeah omega lol oh man with the the big c word in the chat wow Wow, the big C calling me a coon. Very interesting. Yeah, go ahead and chide that person. 
If anybody sits there and calls me that word, oh man, that is just wrong. Melanie uh, Mendez, I'll pay you a hundred dollars to come if you can come with your picture, like with your actual who you are. I'll pay you a hundred dollars if you come and debate me live. Why I'm that? Why I'm that word? But with your with your camera, actually in in your in IRL, your actual picture and everything. I will pay you a hundred dollars to come to, and and say and like give me give me the reason why I'm that a hundred dollars. Hit me up on Twitter. You're banned from here, but hit me up on Twitter if you think that I'm that. I'll pay you a hundred, and I'll know I'll make more than a hundred off of it because of the the Ninja Village will come and support. So I'll pay you a hundred to come and prove that. I'll put a, and David Drayton, David. So we'll give you two hundred dollars to come and prove that I'm that word. Two hundred dollars to come on live, but with your face. You're, Cause you're probably a guy. I don't think I don't think you're a girl. A girl wouldn't say something that dumb. So you're. I know you're a guy. Um, so I'll pay. We'll pay you two hundred dollars. Two hundred dollars to come and prove that in a live debate. <clears throat> and I think we got some more people saying double. Uh, two hundred bucks. Let's see here. Alucard says I'll put in a hundred. Three hundred dollars. Three hundred dollars to come and prove it. You've got to come prove it though. You come on live and prove it, you get your money. So give me, give us examples. Give us good examples of why I would be that. So $300 to come prove it. Camera and everything. Um, Marlon uh, uh, Su Suo says, I like the Naruto theme of your channel. Thank you. I appreciate that. Um, there's actually a very small difference between Peach and Daisy. I think it's uh, turn up damage or something. Yeah, there's very small things. Yeah, that's you're, you're right, J2 Blue. That's, that's an instant ban. That's a, especially for that. Especially for that. That's to me, that's actually worse than some of the other things people call, you know, African Americans out there. That's actually worse because that's like, yo, wait a minute, hold up here. You're saying that I hate myself? Okay. You're saying that I hate I hate my people? That that to me is that's worse. That that's ridiculous. I don't think anybody would sit there and say that about me. But hey, like I said, I love I've had other people like I've had other people tell me like Uncle Tom and stuff like that. I'm like, hmm, come prove it. Nobody wants to come talk to me about it. Um, let's see here. Uh, William says, uh, did, uh, did Clues ask for a money match? I saw the Twitter post the other day. He said that he'd like to money match me at some point. He said that he'd like to money match at me. But I mean, I don't have a problem just playing Clu uh, you know, playing, uh, playing, uh, Clues normal. You know what I'm saying? Like, I have no problem playing him normal. The reason why that I, I don't even money, I don't even challenge people to money matches. I don't challenge people to money matches at all. I said that if you think that you're going to three stock me and pick randoms, then I'll challenge you to a money match. If, if that's what you think, oh yeah, the money match, <laughs> hundred dollar money match. No problem um let's see here go on urban diction iron destruction go on urban dictionary and look up what that is my uh, uncle tom look it up on urban dictionary um who is better diddy kong or donkey kong and smash ultimate i personally feel that um i personally feel that donkey kong is a little bit better but i don't think diddy kong is bad Let's see here. Yeah, you're right. Uh, Gray Fuller, you're absolutely right. Yeah, you're absolutely right. Although, you know, um, there are different words for in terms of the meaning. But, yeah, yeah. Well, I guess we'll just leave it right there, right? Um, Diddy Kong has seen better days. The only problem with Diddy Kong is his banana peel. That, that's the thing. I don't think Diddy Kong is as bad as what people say Diddy Kong is. But the problem is that Diddy's... The whole gimmick of Diddy Kong was the banana peel, right? And now the banana peel... Um, and now the banana peel, um, you didn't have to delete that, um, you didn't have to delete that comment, thank me, that was fine, you didn't have to delete that comment, and that Grateful Fuller put, that was fine, um, <clears throat> but, uh, like, I think the whole problem with Diddy Kong is that people think, oh, well, he's not as good as Smash 4, so he sucks, and that's not the case, Diddy Kong is still good, he still has his frame data, he still has his, his, his comp, he still has his down tilt combos, he still has his stuff, the only thing is that his banana peel is this stupid little, like, <laughs> it's like this two-part little, Huh. it's like he like William Shatner is it you know what I'm saying like eh, eh. and then he throws it and then it goes at this arc it goes at this arc that's really hard to just like back air and catch it so it's just that's the problem with Diddy Kong is that you can't get the cheap banana you know the banana throw kills you know so yeah um yo what up Crit Astro he says uh, what do you uh what's up OJ uh what do you think is gonna get nerfed in uh Smash Ultimate update uh maybe Wolf's Blaster um so yeah I think that that's gonna get nerfed maybe I hope nobody gets nerfed, though. Um, I really hope nobody gets nerfed. Oh, also, shout out to, uh, is it Thomas? Thomas Mutis. I think we pretty much hit five subs subscribers during the stream, guys. 
So I think we hit our goal. Yeah, we did actually, because because uh, we had we we had how many subscribers did we have during this? We had um one, two, three, four, five, six, seven new subscribers during the stream, dude. I think that's like a freaking record, man. During this, well, no, it's not a record, but during like a PE live, that's that doesn't happen very often. So thank you guys for the subscriptions, appreciate it. Welcome to the village, all the all the new people. Thank you, thank you. I, I do appreciate that. I do appreciate, despite what some people think, I'm not just this mean dude that sits there and gets mad at his users. I'm actually a really nice person. It's just that I want to talk to you guys real. As the Hokage, I talk to you guys real. Nobody, none of these other YouTube content creators, they don't want to look like they won't talk to you guys for real. You know what I'm saying? So we talk to you guys for real here. Also, shout outs to um, Aragorn Curry with the subscription as well. Thank you so much, Aragorn. As Aragorn Curry, I appreciate you subscribing. Welcome to the village. And if you're not subscribed and you're watching the and you're watching, definitely make sure you hit that subscribe button. Thank you. Also, for the new subscribers, make sure you guys follow me on Twitter too. So if you're not following me on Twitter, that's gonna get you guys updates when I stream because YouTube barely works. Uh, YouTube barely works at times. Uh, Reggie, Reggie got some cool stuff, man. I'm gonna I'm gonna talk about what Reggie got later. Uh, we're almost done though. We have five more minutes on the stream, so, um, so yeah. <clears throat> Let's see here. I don't use Twitter, bro. It's all good. If you don't use Twitter, that's cool. For those who do use Twitter, follow me on Twitter. Um, Ravi, Ravi is well with the subscription. Thank you so much, Jack Sways. Thank you so much for the subscriptions, guys. Appreciate that. I just sub. Thank you. Welcome, welcome, um, little Omar picture main guy. Um, thank you so much. I appreciate that, guys. That's definitely more than ten subscribers for the stream. That's that's definitely a record for a regular PE live. Absolutely. For and not like a special event. Special events we've had way more. Like I think like the Game Awards in two thousand or twenty seventeen. The Game Awards, like we had two hundred people subscribe at one. Like literally. 200 people hit the subscribe button at one point and it was literally just flashing the like the, the freaking shadow clone for like like an hour dude or I had, to, I had to cut it off because so many people subscribed at one point um uh thank you also jordan r with the subscription as well man thank you appreciate that <clears throat> let's see here Oh, uh, the lag is gone. Good job. Yeah, the lag was there because <clears throat> because I was actually recording. The thing about recording, live recording, is that it's instantly available, so it taxes your CPU a little bit. If you're streaming and you're and you're live recording, it's going to be a it's going to be a, a little bit of a CPU tax. You've got to have something at 720p. But when I record my footage, my gameplay footage, it's at 1080p. So having a CPU running a stream with all these graphics and everything that I have stuff switching and alternating and all the stuff that i have on top of that having like recording at 1080p plus streaming in 1080p yeah that caused that caused some issues that caused some issues because yeah the stream goes up to 1080p six this stream it runs at 1080p 60 frames per second and then i'm also recording at 1080p 60 frames per second that's gonna and, and from and to be honest for me to to have it to where some of you guys weren't having issues and that's that's i think the cpu is good dude i think my cpu is not bad i think the fact that like my stream didn't completely crash i think that's pretty cool i mean that's pretty cool um tyler epic says what mic do you use for your channel yeah i use an audio technica this is one of the best uh high quality high quality not super expensive and high quality mics that you can get is an audio technica once again shout outs to uh you know the village you guys really helped me out with this one last year i think i got it so because my mic quality was trash i was using a blue yeti was not good um and i got this audio technica last year and i've loved it ever since it's very 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 good very good very good mic uh god dang it sorry <laughs> sorry about that guys I, I put it down and it freaking it, it hit the side of my of my desk um i need to really i need to get that that thing right there um See, my mic is super crisp quality. Uh, Rode microphones are high quality. Yeah, I got a Rode microphone too. I've actually got a Rode microphone. Um, shout outs to Matthew Hammond and for the Ninja Village. You guys helped me out with this one, but I, I've got one right here. Uh, so yeah, I do got a Rode microphone. Those are good. They're good. Those are good. Um, I didn't drop it. I just, it just, the what's it called? The side of the mic, like the, the, the kickstand thing. 
clanked off of the uh, clanked off of the side of my desk. So. Um. All right, guys. We got. I, this is probably gonna be the last question. And he says, uh, speaking of Smash Brothers Ultimate Fighters Pass, I have a prediction. What are the chances of getting Crash Bandicoot? Very, very, very low. Very, very low. Very low. I don't think Crash Bandicoot's going to be in the game. But you never know, right? You never, never know. All right, guys. That's going to wrap it up for this one here. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Sorry for the... Oh, my God. Out of nowhere. Yo. Shout out to Miles Morales at the very end with the Toby Blaster. Let's go swooping in. Like the Hokage at the end of the stream. Yo, thank you so much, Miles Morales. I appreciate that. You are also finishing the stream as the top stream boss. K19 had very little HP left. And I thought K19 was going to win it for today. But um, no, Miles Morales with the $20 donation um, does the very last end kill there. And says, yo, OJ, can you tell me what time it is here in Philly? JK, put your dollars. Put your dollars. In your pockets. Let's go. <laughs> for the new subscribers and for the new people, I will tell you the dollars in your pocket story later. So come out for Joker later tonight. If you want to know what that stupid thing that I just did and what that means with that donation, if you want to know, come out later tonight. And uh, I, will, I will tell you guys the full dollars. dollars in your pocket so thank you so much man appreciate it appreciate it so we will see you guys um later uh dank meme one of the mods dank meme he actually just uh put my latest video so make sure you guys check out my latest video if you want my reaction to joker that's already up as well but make sure you guys check out some of the videos view counts aren't necessarily too high on there um you guys give some shout outs and some emotes to miles morales as well for the 20 dollars donation do appreciate that um but um the video the, the views aren't necessarily too good on the videos we're, we're doing okay but make sure you guys check out the latest 3.0 update that i did video and also my live reaction to the to that as well make sure you guys check out both of those um i will have a mortal Kombat 11 live reaction that we just did um i will have a reaction to that up on the channel at some point so look out for that i guess it should only be like a minute long but then again i forgot to end it well but anyway never mind i, I might not even upload that because i forgot to hit the end record so anyway Thank you guys so much uh, for watching. I do appreciate it. Yeah, Wolf is one of my mains. Wolf is one of my mains. Let's see. Let's see what they do. So, guys, we got a couple more hours. Still Joker. Joker is going to be out in about two hours. Two hours, Joker will be out. So, we'll see you guys back on the stream. We'll probably be starting up a little bit early. Uh, we'll download Joker. We'll go through the whole process. And then uh, we'll get right into it. We'll get right into Joker and the Persona stage and everything like that and the music. So, thank you guys so much for watching. I do appreciate it. And uh, we'll see you guys very soon. Make sure you guys check out the rest of the videos if you want more Joker uh, talk, uh, live reactions, all that stuff I have on the channel. Also, make sure you guys check out my Switch News video on like Marvel Ultimate Alliance. I got a release date. So for those who are new, you're looking for the next one. Um, also, another video that I think a lot of you guys would probably like would be the Why I'm Terrified About Next Gen video. Why I'm Terrified About Next Gen. I'm ter Why I'm Worried About Next Gen. So, um, check out that video too. If you haven't seen it, check it out. Good video. It's actually a pretty good views. It's like 3.3 uh, thousand. So not bad, not bad on the view count there. So, uh, you guys check that out. Uh, watch the videos, uh, get informed on all the different latest news. And we will see you guys back later here in about two hours for Joker premier Joker gameplay. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you guys so much for the support today. I do want to go over real quick before we, before we finish, I do want to go over all the people who did support today. That's one thing I'm going to start doing a little bit more is kind of going doubling back down and going over the people that did support. Uh, so uh, let me load this up. So shout out to Miles Morales. Thank you so much, man. Appreciate that for the 20. Theory Tiger and also Robert as well. Thank you guys for the donations. Appreciate that. Also, uh, K19 with the donation. Big Toby Blaster. Thank you. And also for the bits as well. Also, thank you to uh, David Drayton as well for the, uh, for the donation too. So thank you, man. I appreciate that. And uh, thank you for all the new subscribers as well. Everybody that subscribed, thank you guys so much. Appreciate it. All right, we're going to be back soon, so I'll uh, we'll see you guys later. Peace.